Wait. Wait, what? Did you see that? See what? I saw somebody that looks like me. How? She's coming out from the... Can we please go and check? You must be very stupid. I saw someone that looks like you. Opera Oban um, Jacob. Mother, can we discontinue doing this, please? I am concerned as a mother. You cannot blame me. I am not blaming you. I'm only asking you to choose a stopping point. To the best of my knowledge, Father has asked you to stop discussing this topic with me. Is it what your father told you? It's not about who told me. It's the fact that I now know the truth. How am I supposed to allow you to choose a wife for me when you constantly disregard, disrespect what your husband told you? Stop discussing this topic with me. Are you not judging me based on that? Oh, Mom, please, I am not judging you. I'm only asking you to give me a break. I have seen other women and none moved me. Son, believe me, you are going to like this one. If only you agreed to meet her. I have met her. I have met her. She did not impress me with her character. She did not give good account of herself. Mom, please, allow me to find my own wife. When I find her, I will be moved. You will know. Please. He has seen me, Rebbe, and he's not moved. How can that be possible? Shifi, called me. Shifi Dika? That flamboyant Shifi Dika who used to command respect of all is now the shadow of himself. Are you not aware? So why are you telling me about Shifidika? The woman Shifidika's son was made to marry is the genesis of Shifidika's problems. I have no business with Shifidika. I'm not connected with him. So why are you telling me that? The link is that this morning I overheard you one more time piling marital pressure on my son. And to the best of my knowledge, this is, this is something I've already told you that I wouldn't want it to happen again. Why did it happen again? Chief, why are you doing this to our son? Look at him now. He's not getting any younger. He should be married by now. And I am telling you that he should be allowed to get married at his convenient time. Chief, he actually broke his son and imposed a woman on him. A young man who had a woman he wanted to marry. And Chief, Chief Dika said no. That he wanted a woman who has business experience. Somebody who is going to help their family business. The young man was broken and this wife was imposed on him. What did she do? She came into that family and instead of transforming the business the way they planned, she succeeded in crippling Chief Yudika's business empire. Chief, the woman that I'm going to choose for her son will be a responsible one. And she's not going to have anything to do with her family business. It's a promise. The person who is going to be living with a woman as his wife must be given the responsibility of finding that woman himself. Listen to me. Do not ever pile pressure, marital pressure on our son again. He must be allowed to choose his own wife. Let this not happen again. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not trying to distract you, but please, what are we really doing here? <clears throat> Calm down.
Mm. Why are you showing me empty box? This box is empty, so why are you opening <coughs> me? <coughs> Listen, Omekito. Biko, Kosia, Omegini. My name is not Omekitolo. My name is Elizabeth. That's the name my mother gave me. Not, 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 not Omeki something. God knows that I will never call you Elizabeth or draw possible. Because Elizabeth called Elizabeth. We never give us the money that we need. I don't understand. Yes, Elizabeth will never give us the money that we need. So you are insinuating that Omekitolo will bring money? Exactly. You see why I said that you should be following me like a child? Stop arguing with me because if you continue this argument, we are not going to see any money. You're still not making any sense to me. The name my mother gave me is Elizabeth, and that's the name I want you to call me. I see, I see. I will talk about In fact, as your child, I will never. Uh, nah, uh, call for what? I won't. Listen, <clears throat> I imported this box of magic from the Temple of Unholy Osis in Abanaba Glary. And from that temple, your name and my name were already programmed as apostles that will minister to this boss and will begin to see money. This is unbelievable. Uh, 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 you mean you took my name to a temple in Aguilera of all places? Do you want to use me for rituals? Hey, 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 just calm down, calm down. You need to calm down because if you calm down, you, you will understand this business. You will understand what I mean by being the apostle and see money. Mm. Okay, I'm calm. What is the business? Good. I'll break it down for you. <clears throat> I tried to use Elizabeth. Eh? It did not work. I tried to use Williams, which is my name. The thing did not work also. And I was, ah, what's going on? Now, one name just came to mind, which is Oluwa. And I used that Oluwa as my name. It worked. Another name came, which is Omeke Tolo. I used that Omeke Tolo as your name, and it worked. So, I have already adopted Oluwa as my name. Just adopt Omekitolo as your name and things will begin to work. Jerry Owula Oluwa, you're still not making any sense to me. I cannot change my name. There's nothing that will make me change my name because all these things you're explaining, I still don't understand you. What has all this got to do with money? Have you forgotten I'm a woman? Women should be careful about the names they answer. My dear, it's my dear, make it, my make dear, it my dear just accept that your name is Omeke Tolo and we shall see money. Mm. I'm telling you. Which money? Accept, just say. See, 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 see. If I accept this name and nothing happens, I will denounce the useless name. Uh, bam, 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 bam. That name is not useless. Do you understand? Don't worry. You will see Abanapo Wanda. Now! Touch it. You can touch it. This 
is amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Eh? This, this is amazing. How did you do this? That's wonder of our banabo. Yes. Hi. <laughs> Nai. This is good. Your name is Omukitolo. Say yes. Of course, now Elizabeth Bakwako. My name is Omakito. Omakito. <laughs> Omakito. <laughs> We are. What is? What is it? You have to do this off, you know. Yes, yes. You have to do it. So come in. Yeah, are okay. Hey, we get it, Allah. Elizabeth, my walker. Elizabeth, my walker. If you call Mr. Laxio, he will tell you how I walk. I do not tolerate idle minds. This business is my concept, the child of my brain. So I will not sit and relax, watch someone hijack it. No. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, come here. Call you back. Ma. Stefan, where are you going? I'm going to the chapel to pray. Are you done with what I asked you to do? Yes, ma. I've done everything you asked me to do. For some days now, I've not been to the chapel and it's beginning to weigh me down. Oh. Ask me, Celessa. Ma! Ma! Look at this. Just take a look at this. I asked this girl to help me wash this blouse. I specifically told her not to use the washing machine on it. I am sure she did use it. Is it true? You never asked me not to use the washing machine. Liar. You're such a liar. Do you, do you know how much this is worth? Oh. This is 25,000 Naira. Are you real, it? Susan, why are you sounding like this? Why are you... Okay, look at the shirt now. Nothing happened to it. Oh, you talk like this because you do not know the value of money. Now will you get back in there and wash this again? Please, Ma, can I do that when I'm back from the chapel? I want to come. Oh, come on, do not get me angry! Sorry, Ma. Sorry, Ma. And you? Does it mean you cannot wash your clothes yourself? Mother! Me? Wash? Why? My friend, get out! But I see Amaka is not your biological mother. After the ghastly motor accident that killed your mother on the spot and sent your father into coma, Malanchi Amaka was the family friend your father remembered when he opened his eyes in the hospital. You were in the vehicle as a child, but nothing happened to you. And when your father was told that you were alive and well, he asked Madame Chiamaka to take you. Your dad died three hours later. Why would my parents die like that? Why would they leave me like that? You do not question God. God knows all things. Just continue living with Madame Chiamaka and pray to God that he will reveal the way forward. But all I can tell you is that your future is bright. Barista, it's not easy. Madame Chiamaka and her daughter are not treating me right. They treat me like a slave. Sometimes I feel like leaving that house. I feel like running away. No, 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 my dear. Don't even think that. Don't ever think of leaving the house. Your father will be mad at you wherever he is. I, I am happy that you, are, you know the importance of prayers. Just continue praying to God and he will direct your path. Hmm? One day you will become a graduate. 
And once that is done, you will know the reason I told you that your future is bright. Even the prayers that helps me to lift the sorrows of my heart, they will not even allow me to pray. <laughs> word again from your mouth. I don't believe in such rubbish you people call witchcraft. And as long as you live in this house, as my child, never you mention such word again. Are you not a disgrace already? You cannot do anything by yourself. Why is she angry? Why? Helen is a witch and she knows it. She's simply a witch. Magic. Hmm. Money is sweet, oh. Where are you gonna do a four way? Where are you gonna do a four way? Oh no, where are you gonna attack Ilishi? Bam. Where am I gonna do a four way? Bam. Hmm. Hmm. Where did you get those tin tomatoes? Those canned food in the kitchen. Where did you get them from? Mama, I've warned you. My name is not Elizabeth. My name is Omeke Tolo. That's my name. If you're finding it hard to call me Omeke Tolo, call me Omeke. Stop calling me Elizabeth. Biko. I don't like it. Are you out of your mind? What is Omeke Tolo? My name. What? Yes. That name is bringing me good luck. That name has changed my life. Ah, Omeki, Omeki. You see the kind of food you're asking about? I got everything from that name. As a matter of fact, it's not just those ones in the kitchen. Oh. I have sold some. And the ones there are for sale. It didn't trust it. It's for negotiation. Well, sell them. And where did you get them from? Does it matter? It does not matter. The most important thing is that your daughter is in business. That's what she should be excited about. Elizabeth, I don't know what you're planning, but I will not allow you to return into a thief in my own house. Mm -mm -mm -mm. If you know what is good for you, go and return them where you picked them from. Point of correction, do not refer to me as a thief. Apokwana monyoshi. My name is Omeke Tolobule Dawe, not a thief. 
I will not take it. You know? No? I like your one now. Good man. And what do you think you're doing? To my room, of course, to shower and sleep. And this rubbish? <laughs> hey, Mama. What are you calling rubbish? Kilishi. Konida Fozo. That's Kilishi now. Nah. Or some rubbish. See, let me tell you, Mama. This Kilishi, I bought it from Alajoma. He's the highest Kilishi seller around here. This is not cheap, but this is 2,000 naira. I've eaten my own. So eat your own. Enjoy yourself. Don't worry, this is your daughter will make you proud of <laughs> Enjoy. That's it, I'll be broken. Why is she turning into a monster like he said? I've thought of this over and over and now. I have come to the conclusion that I cannot be part of this. I am leaving this town. Leave him? To where? Don't worry about it. You shall know when the time comes. And just understand that that child is someone else's child. I want you to trust the parents and give them back their child. So why are you sounding like a broken drum? That child you're talking about, her name is Elizabeth. A child I already baptized. I will not return her to anybody because she is my child. Listen, if you're already tired of this relationship, of this marriage we are trying to manage, and you're tired of this town, you can live to wherever you chose. I don't care. But listen, one more thing. Listen to what I'm going to tell you. If you open your mouth to tell anybody about this, you know what it means for another officer like you to go to jail. I will send you to jail and you lose everything. You can go if you want. Well, I'm not going to expose your evil to anyone. Better. But I believe posterity will catch up with you. And then again, I want you to read my lips. That Elizabeth is going to grow into a monster right under your nose. And you will have multiple reasons of ever stealing an innocent child. Mm -mm. They don't say that about my child. That my Elizabeth is going to go into an international star. Oh, really? I'll be happy she will call you father. Wrong again. She will not call me father because I will be nowhere to be found. She has a father. And when the time comes, you will regret ever doing this to the same people who trusted you. But don't forget that. So you don't have to leave. But you can stay. I come up in my nutshell. Come along in the day. Man, no more what you know not to. Give me can give me zero. Zero was never a seer. He was a mere naval officer who never achieved anything tangible. All through the period I was married to him, he never attended any church. How was he able to see the future of this Elizabeth? To know she would develop into a monster right under my nose. drink my my hot drink so just have to give you this one so that you can eat it and ginger your spirit when you're done eating take this and wash it down i know you might not want to drink my alcohol so just use this energy drink <laughs> and then it dies <laughs> I, 
Ah, that's why I'm out to my eye. Why are you doing this to your mother? Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, don't worry. See, I've not even started with you. And you're already getting very emotional. Check out my ego. When I make this money. Oh. Don't worry, I'll give you a treat. Don't cry. Go, go and enjoy yourself, Nico. Tell me one more the happy. Why are you crying? Enjoy! <laughs> Civilized way to enter a lady's room. Excuse me. Can't you be decent for once? Excuse me. Are you talking to me? Please. I've already said my prayers. I'm about sleeping before you batch them. What do you want? Uncle Barry is around. He said he's hungry. He wants to eat pounded yam. My mother said you should come down and prepare it for him. Hey? Are you people serious? You know, human. Why would he ask for pounded yam by this time of the night? How can a human being eat pounded yam by this time of the night? <laughs> Wait a minute. What are you trying to prove? Huh? Are you trying to prove that you know more than Uncle Barry or what? Oh, please don't put words in my mouth. Excuse me. I come up in my thing I did was to call him and I asked him to call Mr. Laxio. I made it crystal clear to them that I do not tolerate laxity and idleness and I'm sure they'll be struggling to understand what I meant by that. Mom! Mom! Mom, can you imagine what she said? What? What she said when I told her that Uncle Barry wanted to eat pounded yam? 
She said, what is wrong with you people in this house? How can a human being eat pounded yam at this time of the night? Can you pick that? Fat idiot feels she's the only civilized person in this house and we're a bunch of local idiots. Wait, wait, wait. Are you joking with me right now? Mm -mm. Wait a minute. Did she really say that? Of course. But that is an insult. Oh, come off it, Barry. Come on. I disagree with you. You are wrong. And for the very first time, I think Helen is right. For real? For real. Sister, did you hear what she said of me? Was it not what I was telling you a few minutes ago? Ugh. Life expectancy has dropped drastically, especially in Africa. People are conscious of what they put in their mouth to eat. Abba, how can you request for pounded yam at this time of the night? In this modern age? Oh, Barry, who does that? Um, I am sorry, sister. But you, you, are, you are giving her the, the audacity to insult me. And I'm not finding it funny. In what way? I told you this because she's not here. If she were to be here, I wouldn't have said that. But come on, guy, relax. <laughs> Panda Diane, oh. <laughs> no, 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 it's too heavy. Um, that's what they call individual differences. And I believe you're entitled to whatever you want to believe. I am surprised mom is not saying the blankets of insults that idiot is putting up. She has no right to educate any of us. Yes, you may continue to fool yourself, but I just came to tell you that Uncle Barry has changed his mind. What do you mean by he has changed his mind? It simply means that he doesn't want to eat pounded yam again. As simple as that. Susan, wait, what will happen to the yam I'm already boiling? Is it your yam? Is the yam yours? That is my mother's yam that just got wasted and she is not complaining. So if you're so particular about the waste, you can eat it when it's boiled. Will I be sure that it was even Uncle Barry that requested for this pounded yam? Why is Susan so wicked? Why are women always wicked to their fellow women? Hey, I asked you to come inside because it is already late. And I would not want my neighbors to start suspecting anything. Come and see that. Do you think I care? Do you think I care whether the neighbors hear or not? If you like now, I will just raise my voice. They will come here and see what you are doing. What is it, eh? madam? Do you want me to grind you to a halt before you advise yourself and leave my daughter alone? What, 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 is, what, what is this? Seriously, as I'm standing here with you right now, I am confused. Yeah? Yes, you are the mother. You are the mother to the woman that I love. Not in your life. You are the mother to my babe. In fact, you are an in-law to me. Just shut your mouth. Madam Demonte, see, you don't know me. I hold you in high esteem. You cannot be quarreling, please. What are possible, okay? Do not hold to me anything. Oluwa or whatever you call yourself, you can never be my in-law because you can never marry my Elizabeth. 
You can never marry my daughter. Not now, not ever. What is this? Hey, okay, hey, fine, Madame Bero. Wait, oh. if Uluwa is not your in law, who then is your in law? I do not have an in law. You are not my uh, in law. Only if you have little sense, small of it in your head, you will understand that whatever that brought me to your house by this time of the night is a serious matter. Stay away from my daughter, or you see me. Are you joking or what, Madame Vero? You are asking me to stay away from the same Mickey Toro that is already wedded with me in the spirit, or I see you. The truth is, is that I am seeing you already, Madame Vero, and I am prepared to see more of you. Understanding that I will never leave Umeke Tolo is not possible. You are a dreamer. You just woke up in the middle of the night and start dreaming. I, just said the dreamer. You should be dreaming and will be dreaming if you ever imagine yourself to get married to my daughter Elizabeth. Listen, Madame, Madame, I, I am just telling the truth. Something that has already happened. We are married, Chad. I am. It is sealed. I am. I, I am not marrying Umeke Tolo that will open doors for me, and I will turn open doors for her. It is already sealed in Abanabo. There's nothing you can. I ain't. I ain't the kagom. I do. I do. We are inseparable. There's nothing you can do to separate us. Somebody, oh, understand this, Madam Veru? All you are. Continue Lebanon Wagi and leave my daughter alone. Ah, do not say I, I did not warn you. What do you do? Stop me? misleading this little girl. Little girl. There are other big girls out there, people in your level and category. Oh, make it a little girl. Leave the girl alone. She's a young girl, very little girl. This is uh, child abuse. Hey. Eh? And listen, hey. one more thing. Stop calling her oh, make it alone. That is not her name. Her name is Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. In mm -hmm. fact, I named her after the Queen of England because she is a queen. Continue loitering yourself around her. And I come here next time. You will like what I'll do to you. Continue the book working and leave my daughter alone. Leave her alone. Rubbish. But I'm like. But I'm very. What kind of nonsense is this now? Eh? What God has joined together, let no man put us on that. If men were not permitted to put us on that, who is Madame Ferro? Madame Ferro? Who will punish you, idiot? Who will punish this woman that is trying to separate the miracle that, that is already sealed in Abanapo? And Oman Bala is too bad, idiot! But I'm very. You. What if you say, what's the name of Bruno Melika? No, Elizabeth. Elizabeth. My name is Omekitono. You idiot, but I'm very. Omekitono, you idiot. Drop on me. Brother Barry, Brother Barry, please yeah? wait. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. Please. And what is it? Uh, please don't be offended. I see you as a brother. If I have any important information that will help, it's my duty to let you know. So what have you called me out to tell me? I want to give you this book. It's a book on dieting. In this era that life expectancy has dropped drastically in Africa, you need a book like this to stay healthy. And uh, what do you mean by that? Though Suzanne finally said you changed your mind, but last night you requested for pounded yam. It's not healthy. It shows you still do not know the principles of dieting. Eating pounded yam at that time is not healthy for anyone. What the hell do you think you have to advise me on dieting? Jesus. Jesus. The next time you try this, you will regret the day you were born. What happened? And why are you 
you screaming like a buffoon? Sister, can you imagine this loafer advising me, Barry, on dieting? Count your stars, it just ended in a slap. Hey! So you can now advise someone on something? Really? How come you've been unable to advise yourself? Sorry, ma. I'm sorry. Anyway, when the vendor comes, tell him I want to see him. Right. Advise her. I come up with my daughter. Oh, my Lord, in the day. Oh, no more what you do not try. Get me, can get me, oh, one and one in now. Is not picking the call. Oh, this guy must I tell you everything? Yeah? If she's not picking call, call her again now. Yeah? Call her till she picks. She just ended the call. What? Are you sure this girl is not up to something? Ah, come on. Why would you say that? Why would you say that? She just ended the call. What, what, what are we going to do now? You know what, Michael? The best thing to do now huh, is to go to her house and threaten her badly. Like, so badly. Go put the no name. This is mafia business. And we have to do it in mafia ways. Do you understand that? I, I understand, my brother. But if you ask me, I, I would say it, it is not the best way. W what? Are, are you okay? Wait, you're not teaching me my, my job? Like, I brought you into this business. You don't tell me what to do. Do you understand? My brother, don't read useless meaning into what I just said. Your situation will, may, may end up putting us in problem now. But you're still saying the same thing. You are teaching me the, I brought you into the world. You are teaching me the job. Now, my brother, we are not arguing who is superior to each other. There is issue on ground here. I'm trying to figure out the best way to approach it. Please, don't bring uh, negative energy to it. Pico. You know what? You know what? Call this girl now. Call her now. Call her now. Call her now. Call her now.
What is the matter with you? You have refused to pay me my three million naira balance. And you have the guts to call me endlessly this morning. What is it? Listen, I'm calling because there is a problem. What problem? We are not talking about the balance anymore. The jewelries you sold to us has been rejected. The Alaji said they are fake. <laughs> he, you're, you're not serious, are you? I am serious. In fact, I am here with John. The same John who paid you the initial four million naira. He was the one who brought the Alaji. And he's angry. Now everything is on my neck. Listen, we need to give you back your fake jewelries and collect back our money. <laughs> Hold on, Michael. You're joking. You're seriously joking. The jewelry I sold to you is my mother's. Wait, have you heard of the woman called Madame Chiamaka of the City of Lights? How on earth do you think her jewelry is fake? Listen to me, woman. My name is John, and I don't joke with money. I don't take bullshit from anybody. Do you understand that? Listen, the jewelries you sold to us have been confirmed as fake by an authority that no jewelries. Listen, I don't want to argue with you. I have your jewelries intact. Alright? Pay me my four million naira. Period. This must be a joke. This is a joke. Hello? Hello? Are you sure this game is going to work? Um. Her mother is a minunia. And there is no way she will agree that her mother's jewelries are fake. One year, I work what? This is a game I've played for years and it keeps working. You see the four million naira? She's owing us. Hmm? She will not be able to cough it out. Or well, you see this three million naira she's expecting from us? Huh? It will be history. The three million naira will be history. <laughs> this is clever. Listen, my brother. This is a new jungle. Hmm? Where the clever ones survive and not the fittest. Uh, uh, and now she will now be the one running away from us. Now you get to the point. Not the other way around. You get to the point. There is something in your head. <laughs> <laughs> now the order now, that's the order. Let's move. Ha, Jero, you mean she came here last night to look for me? Nah, eh? I was even thinking that you told her something. Yeah? I don't, I don't, I don't understand, Madame Vero. Omeke Tolo and Uluwa have been wedded in Abanabo. And I made it clear to Madame Vero that. Twenty of Madame Veros put together can never put us under or what are you? What is going through your head? Experience. Experience on how we are going to be cashing money in a house. That is what is running through my head right now. I thought you know. Yeah? I thought you know already. The way that we will be, we'll be, you know, invoking cars everywhere. They are too kind. I don't, why, why are you asking me questions? Um, now? Why, listen, why are you changing your Uluwa, case? listen, 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 listen. Gekwaya <sighs> Manti. The relationship I have with you is purely business relationship, not love affair. In Anya. In Anya Nawagana. I have the picture of the man I would want to call mine. <laughs> Okay, 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 do okay. Tall, dark, sexy, calm, cute, handsome. You need a girl's ways. You want a total package, full option. Not you. Get quite a guy. If I know that, tall. 
Allah. You know if you reach at all, at all, at all, at all, at all. No, no, no. You wrong. So stop thinking or assuming that I am your wife to be. Oh, man. What kind, of, what kind of nonsense is this now? Why are you insulting me? Can you get insulting me? Why are you insulting me here now? Eh? Can you get a man that will marry you? As you're looking at me now, I'm starting back off. What nonsense is that now? Eh? The worst part of it is that you, you don't hear me at all. That I did not fit in at all. You idiot. What nonsense is that? Take a moment. Oh, I can become a chair gunner. No. Let's go and do the no, business. No, no, fine, fine, fine. If, if, if Oluwa here, or Oluwa that you are seeing here, did not fit into the man that, who, who, that, that will be your husband, describe to me that. Describe to me the man that you want to be your husband. No, describe to me. Oba, 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 Kaginime, see, 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 I am here for the business that made me change my beautiful Elizabeth to make it all up. Go and bring the magic box, okay, him. let's go and do business. Boutique. No, 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 what does that you, see, see, let me tell you, let me tell you something that you don't know. You belong to me. In fact, you fucking belong to me. And nothing, I said, nothing, nothing a group of Madame Verros can do about it. You belong to me, everything. That part of, you belong to me. I, I must tell you, go, don't provoke me. I must, don't, don't, don't just, hey, 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 don't provoke me. Don't provoke me. Me that part, I do not. I will need you on a go moto. Private jets, come man. I, 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 I have to. Oh, but you you belong to me. Oh, I must tell you where. Oh, my, oh, but you don't provoke me, please. Yeah, Williams, me cheer gone. Oh, my, don't worry. Drop on the day for town. Oh, my, don't worry. We say both in a bad. Ebe faga fell if it was. If it was. Ebe fa bota if it was. Listen to me, woman. My name is John, and I don't choke with money. I don't take bullshit from anybody. Do you understand that? Listen, the juries you saw to us have been confirmed as fake by an authority that no juries. Listen, listen, young lady. I don't want to argue with you. I have your stuffs intact. All right? Pay me my four million naira. Period. Where will I get the 4 million naira to balance this, guys? How is this even possible? How can my mom's jewelries be fake? How am I going to handle this? Humphrey. Yeah, huh? You know, I would be totally disappointed if you told me that you love me simply because of my mother's wealth. Susan, how could you say a thing like this? I'm talking to you because I know you're in good position to her. If I'm not talking to my woman if, when I have a problem, who then will I be talking to? But, baby, I am a student. Where in this world would I get five million naira? Where? You know my mother will not give me. You know it. Why are you not bothered about my problems? You have already concluded. Why you have not even talked to your mother? You know this is wickedness. I'm not even expecting it from you. Oh baby. I am sorry if I make you feel that way. But I know my mother and I know what she can do. There is no way my mother will give me five million naira. It is not possible. <sighs> what else do you want me to do? So you want me to see it and want this massive opportunity to slip off my hand, right? That's what you want. Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if a moment I can't do it, oh, well, I love my life, I can't do it. Why am I so unfortunate?
unfortunate Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if I'm a man, I can't do it Oh, well, I don't know I can't do it I Yo, what's up? Hey, baby. How are you? Mm, I'm fine. Yeah. How did it go? Um. Did you succeed? Yeah, I did succeed. That's wonderful. Um, Humphrey. Yeah. I did this because of you. Okay. I I sold my mother's significant part of her jewelries just for you. And I don't even know how she'll feel if she she finds out what happened. Susie. You're an angel. I don't even know how to thank you for your kindness. Well, this is four million naira. That is what they paid to balance three million naira at the end of the month. Once I get the balance, I will give you one million naira you need to augment for the five million naira. <laughs> You're just one in a million, baby. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, baby. Yeah, sweetheart. <laughs> Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if I'm a man, I can't do it. Oh, well, I don't know I can't do it. Why am I so What is wrong with this girl? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if I'm a man, Listen, if you call someone on phone and he's not picking, you should give the person a break. Humphrey, what the hell are you talking about? Are you, are you talking to me? Hey, listen, young woman. I'm in the center of an important business. I don't want anybody to ruin my room. Listen, the people who gave me the four million naira, they want it back. They say the, the jewelries I sold to them are fake. I still can't understand it. But that's what they said. Please, I want you to return the money. Nonsense. The number you have dialed is currently switched off. Please try again later. Thank you. The number you dialed is switched off. Please try again later. The number you dialed... The number you dialed is switched off. Please try again later. The number you dialed... What exactly are you trying to prove? That you know more than me or what? I never said so. I'm only advising you as a sister. Susan, that Humphrey guy is not good for you. And what makes you think so? You don't even know this guy. So why are you trying to inflict my relationship with my guy? With your witchcraft? I'm not a witch. And this has nothing to do with witchcraft. As a matter of fact, I've interacted with this your Humphrey guy. He's just a time bomb waiting to explode. Susan, get rid of him before he gets rid of you. <sighs> get rid of him before he explodes in your life and tear you into smidgens. <laughs> just look at this local thing. So because my mother has sent you to school, you can now speak grammar to me. It's, this is not about grammar. I want you to look into this. Oh. This Humphrey guy is going to break your heart. Oh. I'm scared he might do it in a way you will never recover. Oh. Get rid of him. 
before it's too late to do so. <sighs> you are just a low life loser. I pray you realize what I'm telling you before it's too late. <laughs> Does it mean she was right? Does it mean Humphrey was not an honest man? Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if I'm a man, I can't do it. Oh, well, I love my can't do it. Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if I'm a man, I can't do it. Oh, well, I love my I can't do it. I. Mother, you're back. Are you okay? You don't look okay. Is everything okay? There's a link one of my friends sent to me. Just take a look at it. You see the kind of rubbish young ladies wear these days, all in the name of fashion? This is disgusting, mother. Oh, thank goodness you know. Because any day I catch you dressing like those ladies in there, you will have a reason to regret why you came into this world through a woman like me. And what is this? Mother, why would you say something like that? I don't dress like the girls. I'm sure the girls in here did not start dressing this way from bed. Believe me, they were dressing like every other normal human. All of a sudden, demon hit them and they changed. Now you listen to me, Susan. Never you make yourself available for this demon to hit you. Else, you will not like the way I will rough handle you and that demon. Give me. And I do not like that in your eating. Okay, I'm Mr. Fine. Yeah? Anything that I tell you about this guy, that is it. No, you know that person can repair that this is there. So what are you suggesting? What I suggested yeah, is for you to go and buy new tires. Your tires are no more good. Go and buy new tires. Yeah? New tires? Don't you understand? Don't you understand that I don't live in this city? I don't live in this town. As you can see that I'm, I'm traveling. I'm, I'm not prepared to buy any tire now. Where do I get money to buy tires? Okay, if you can listen to me, what I can tell you now is to buy at least four spare tires. Your tires are no more good and you are going to travel with all those bad tires. Go and buy about four spare tires. Yeah? It will not be one day now, one tire go bust, they go begin the lie accusation on devil. Say devil do this one, devil do that, do that one. Okay, but that, there must be something you can do to help me out. I don't have the money now to buy four tires. Four tires! Uh -uh. Okay. Let me know what I can do. Hmm. I am just in a feast. What will I do now? Uh, 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 now, how much will you pay? I can supply you four tires. You were actually listening to us. Hey! <laughs> you are not hiding what you were saying. I had it. Yeah? It is even good for you because I already know that 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 you are broke. How can you say things like I that? I know, I know, okay. You don't know who is standing here. Do you know me before? I, yeah. No, 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 no. Listen, uh, uh, in the spirit of uh, friendship, I can assist you with four tires. How much will you pay? Okay, the truth of the matter is that. I don't have any plan of buying tires. Talk more of tires. Four tires. I know, I know, no, I know. No. I know that you you are not planning to buy tires today. 
But you can see now, see you are kind of, you are kind of sparked and you are now grounded. Yeah? Uh, 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 see, Oga, uh, pay me 20,000 and I will supply you with four brand new tires now. Four brand new tires for 20,000 naira? Four brand new tires for 20,000 naira? That's too poor. Or the too poor. Oga, I already know that you are broke. So, this 20,000 just because you are broke. That I'm broke. I know, just see, uh, I, will, I will supply you. For for bra I'm not gonna more than that. For is that with what I prove you just for twenty thousand naira. Okay, we are, we are not ready. Fine, I'll make it all. Okay, okay, okay. Don't worry, don't worry. Let me see it first. Okay, you you won't do it. Uh, 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 seeing is believing. Yes, I need to see what I want to buy. I thank you. No need, don't need the problem. Forget this one. Don't worry. Okay, is that possible? Uh, can they really provide me for new tires for 20,000 naira? My brother, what I can tell you is that this is a city of light, okay. which is everything can be possible. So you better try your luck. Let, let, me, let me wait and see now. Oh, my kid, don't worry. Why are you such a terrible man? Why are you stretching your log too far? Why are you such a terrible man? Kenny Hose? Ozube? I'm asking you. Why are you stretching your log too far? What is your problem, Omekitolo? What is this now? What, what nonsense is this now? What do you mean? Hey, 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 you. Why are you stretching your log too far? What, what do you mean I'm stretching your log too far? Huh? Hypocrisy, hypocrisy. Do you know the tire you're talking about? Oliwa, you're talking about car tire. Or dizzy. Okay, let's go. See, see, see. We have already invoked rappers. We have already invoked these rappers. Let's go and sell it. Let's sell these rappers and make money. I'm close for the day. Can you tell me about it? What's your problem? Can you give me the money? What nonsense is this now? What do you mean close for the day? See, see, see. We are not closing for the day, are closing for the day because they are, they are, they are still more money to be made today. Uh, uh, listen to my dollar. Our souls were tied together in our banabo, and that is marriage. So stop this rubbish that you are saying eh, eh, that I cannot marry you because I am marrying you already. Do you understand? I am marrying you already. Yeah? This thing works by the agreement of the parties involved. Both of us are the party. Agree with me in this administration and we shall see tires to send to that stranded man. Yes! It's just parties. We are the parties involved. So just agree. We agree. Then we we'll, we'll see tires. If we minister after the administration, wow, you see tires here now. They will say to that str str stranded man, you know, see here now, rubbish. What's the go? I agree. <laughs> yes, uh, yes, why are you looking at me like that? I said no problems. I've agreed. I've agreed, right? <laughs> so, young man, these four tires are very, very okay. They are exactly what I want. Give me your very last price, your last price, and I promise you right here, I will make your payment. Okay, see, eh? I don't talk too much. Eh? These tires you see here now are full option, pure one. So each one of them like this is 12,000, and four of them like this is 48,000. So if you buy this tire like this, I give you two years guarantee. We'll talk about tires again. So the whole four tires is 48,000. 48,000. <laughs> Come back, come back here. Yeah. Relax. Why are you running away? Why are you running away? Relax. Eh? No, yeah. Come now. What do you do? You said you to be afraid. Hi. Yes. You said it though. And you did it. But hold on. Are these real tires? <coughs> oh, for idiot. They are little tires. They are little tires. Idiot. Check. Good. Oh, what is that? 
<laughs> Real tires! Hey! Were you not the one that I've been saying? Hey, we're talking about tires, tires. Hey, you this again, you fuck this again. <laughs> May you this You are my wife. I was so proud of you. I am married already. You are my wife. Okay, where is my tire? Take your filthy hands off my tire. What do you mean? Okay, where is my tire? I said, take your hands off. Okay, wait. Where is my tire? Okay, wait. Okay, wait. Where is my tire? Okay, wait. Okay, wait. What did happen here, sir? Have you lost your mind? Where is my tire? What are you talking about? What did they happen? Okay, what did they happen? I don't know what this man is talking about. This man is the magician. Onya, onya, where go? Are you sick upstairs? I don't even have an idea of what you're talking about. And who are you calling a magician? Okay, I'm going you the yarn. Today is the first day you walked into my shop, and today is the first day such incident is happening. That's why I'm going to my tire. What is wrong with you? Okay, you must provide my tire. You are sick upstairs. You must upstairs. provide my tire. You took you are sick upstairs. You must provide my tire. You took with your I don't know what you're I'll talking about. I'll tell you about. the reason why they call me stone. Okay, if this man is tired back, listen to me. I don't have his tires. Okay, you have my tire. I don't know what he's talking about. I am not a magician. Okay, give this man his tire back. If you not give this man his tire back, if people gather here now, they go burn you alive. What is wrong with you guys? I said I don't have his tires! Okay, you must provide my tire. Okay, you must provide okay, my tire. Take your filthy hands off my tire. What is wrong with you? Okay, Why am I even wasting Take your hands off my shirt! Okay, Why am I even wasting time? Take your filthy hands off my shirt! Okay, wait, wait, okay, wait. Take your filthy hands off my shirt. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. Oh my god. <laughs> this is magical. Yes, uh, I'm telling you. Who brand new tire? Exactly. Ta 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 that will last forever for you. Yes. Where did you get it from? Nah, okay, 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 where did you get it from? What does it start now? Okay, we have paid you from your frustration. And I said, okay, okay, okay. Just give us, pay us what we agreed. Okay, 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 okay. And I said, where did you get it from? Okay, 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 okay. Just give us. Nah, the last, nah, the last. Nah, the last. Yeah. Tonight, my brother, it's not me, eh? I will say me in urgent to repair them. Because I try to see these tires. Yeah? It's more than 60,000 naira. Ah, who was now? Ross, now. Ross, you sabi. You no. sabi. Guy, guy, you they mad. No, you, 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 you don't they Chris. Yeah? Please, sissy, sissy, don't provoke me all. Because if you provoke me, you don't go like her. Which kind of nonsense thing be this one now? Nah? When I know they like something way fresh, way good, way smooth. Super. Because we carry this tire, I give you 20,000. You, you they do yeah. nonsense inquiry. Are you sure it's good? Are you sure it's good? Shut up, shut up, don't push your gun. I put your mask on. See, let me tell you, if you don't want to buy this tire, we, in fact, let's take our tire and go. We gave you four brand new tires for 20,000. Oh, yeah, 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 Oh, what, 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 Hey, bros, you ask something for us. No, jokes apart, you have to ask something because if we can elevate this tire, it should be more than 70,000. Ask something. Madam, the madam. Oh, Salaka, can I make? You can't get this anywhere. Yes. Guy, can I pay a tire? Guy, can I pay a tire? Guy, can I pay a tire? Now, now, what? Now, what? Now, what? Now, what? Now, what? Now, what? Hey, who? Idiot! Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Idiot. Calm down. Calm down. Look for something and give to you. Do the task. Calm down. Oh, calm. Dalo, Dalo. Check what we did. This time will last forever. Idiot. You were here and I'm not about to get it. Idiot. Idiot. Eh. Eh. Come on, come on, come on. 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 Come on, come I'm a law-abiding citizen of this country, and that is why I decided to get the police involved. Tell this man here to give me my money in food for 8,000 naira. Officer, with profound respect to you, I walked in here innocently to prize his tires. And then, before my very eyes, his tires disappeared into thin air. 
How am I supposed to make payment for something I absolutely know nothing about? Am I supposed to pay for that? Such nonsense has never, never, but for once, for me to be, happened in my shop. Today is the first day this man walked into my shop and my tie just disappeared before my very own eyes. I don't know why I'm tie. What is wrong with, with this man? Right when I heard it, this man must pay for my tie. I'll go put what I have before he's still poor. Listen to me, I did nothing. Both of you should just calm down. Something strange has been happening in this town. It has been on for two days now. Just yesterday, a woman who sells tin tomatoes and other canned food items down Trinity Road complained that a very large quantity of her goose disappeared before her very eyes. What? Then, just this morning, a woman who sells Hollandis down Vane Road South equally complained that her wrappers hanging on her shelves in her shop equally disappeared before her very eyes. And you are here complaining of four tires disappearing from your shop. We are investigating who is the brain behind it. Officer C, you have nothing to investigate on the matter that has already been investigated. This man here is the culprit. This man is the, is the, is the brain behind everything. You have nothing to investigate. This man magically and evocally stole my tire. I am just not going to snatch up with me, see? I said, I'm not going to You cannot conclude that he is the brain behind anything for he has not been investigated. This is the new police. We don't work that way. O officer, I do not understand though. This man had up on a shop. Why are you going to him? I do not understand. Are you telling me you are going to let this man walk out of this my shop without paying me my 48,000? Officer, 48,000 can you go you? It is a very huge amount of money. This man is not going anywhere. Why are you going to go to the shop? It's alright. We are going to document your case as one of the cases we have in this our disappearance dimension. We have commenced investigation already, and we shall keep you posted. Does it mean you don't have more important things to occupy your thoughts? Why are you always thinking about men? I am not always thinking about men, as you said. I'm just asking this question because, just as you want, Humphrey has turned out to be a time bomb. Do you know what? I have more important things to do this morning. I can't. Oh, please, Helen, wait. Please, hold on. How do you do it? Is it some kind of special power or something? How do I do what? I don't know what you're talking about. How do you always know the right men without even interacting with them? You amaze me, you know. All the things you told me about all the guys I have dated turned out to be true. It's giving me concern. How do you get your information? Our beloved mother, Chiamaga, is not that religious. But she has more Bibles than many women in the church. Why don't you pick one of those Bibles scattered all over this house? Sit down. Read it. The promise is sure. You will know the truth, and only the truth shall set you free. Excuse me. Who the hell do you think you are to tell me shit? Just because I asked you a simple question, you can keep your advice or opinion to yourself. I don't need it anymore. She can never change. Um, should I tell you the truth? I like our altar the way it is. I don't know why Chief Achebe wants to turn into marble. That money could be for something else. That means you don't know Chief Achebe very well. Chief Achebe is a man of class and style. He believes since he worships here, the church should be classy. It's not about charity, it's about who he is. That's why he contacted us so that we can change the entire place to marble. So, the least you could do for me is cooperate. Well, uh, I'll sit to it. Uh, please, please. Father Leo, good afternoon. Good afternoon. You're welcome. <laughs> I 
I just saw you and decided to say hello to you. I'm already done with prayers. I'm heading home. Okay. Bye. God bless you. Um, this, this girl, the, the la this particular girl, the last time we came to take measurements, I saw her praying. Like she prays every day here. You she, are right there. She's one of the few young women who know the importance of prayer. She's always here, same time, every day. Wow. Father, please, if you don't mind, I, I, I would like to follow up with the girl. Please. <laughs> okay, you have my permission. Thank you very much. See, I don't know why you're reluctant about this now. Eh? I'm telling you the truth. I need it right now. This is what we need right about now. You make it alone. The truth is that we are partners. We are building a relationship. You understand this thing? We are building a relationship. Eh? 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 The difference, however, is that you are a woman and I am a man. Women and men do not always think alike. Understand this thing? Yeah, understand it? Chedugodu, Chedugodu. What has your submission got to do with it? Yeah, nah. uh, what has it got to do with this? But hold on. Are you trying to say that you're smarter than me? Eh? Mba, mba, you, are, you are smarter. You are smarter. You are smarter. Because I don't have time for argument. You nah. can't argument. You can't I don't have time. In fact, you are the professor and I am the student. Do you understand? Do you understand? The issue is that invoking a car now nah, I draw possible. We cannot just double into something that will put us into trouble now. What trouble are you talking about? What trouble are we talking about? Trouble, trouble, trouble. It was a guy. It was a pair. See, this is a magic box can invoke anything. You invoke car. Later, you invoke duplex. Later, you invoke. You know, uh, we can invoke ourselves to London. Even yes. though he has a name. Who can we invoke ourselves? Estate. Idiot. That rubbish. If we invoke car, later, I invoke a car. What are we going to tell the people? Yeah? Do you, do, you, do you even know how to drive? See, I can drive. My ex-boyfriend paid for me. I can drive very, very well. No, Chelo, no. walking out on me. What would I walk out on you? What would I walk out on you? What would I walk out on you? What would I you? You are insulting me before me and telling me that my wife to be, he, 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 he said, look over. Now I'm going to you mad. Left of off what? Oh, of the idiot that you just mentioned as your ass. When I like you, you're a man. You're a man. You're a man. I've said what I've said, though, and I will not reverse it. The thing is, I used to have a boyfriend. He's my ex. Go back to that, your ex. Go back to that, your ex. I am not going to evoke any car. Idiot. Don't provoke me. Don't provoke me. Don't provoke me. I'm telling you, my ex. I am sorry. 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 <laughs> You can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Fine. You, you, you are doing this now. Don't worry. I will invoke a white woman. Oh no, child. That will replace you. Mm. Yeah, but you have to invoke her now. Come on, girl. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Mama, I want you to keep this money for me. Are you keeping it or not? This one you're looking at it like that. Elizabeth, you're beating about the bush. Where did you get the money from? Ibiakwa. What kind of question is this now? Nah? Century in this era that people are doing different things to make money. You're asking me on my where did I get the money from? Biko mama in a debe kid debe. Will you keep the money for me or not? Elizabeth. Do you know the school you attended? Elizabeth, it is Queen's College. Queen's School of the Honorable the Elite. Elizabeth, I sacrifice my personal comfort to ensure that you, my daughter, attended that college. And to my disappointment, you learned nothing from that school. You learned absolutely nothing from that school. Mama, do you 
want to insult me? Mama, please don't insult me. Huh? Let me tell you the truth. All the girls that attended Queen's College, none of them can even talk where I'm talking. None of them can even come close to me. In Anya. So please, keep this money for me, Biko. Hmm. I am not talking down on you, Elizabeth. Oh. Hey, hey, Mama, stop, stop. What is Elizabeth said? I'm on your time. My name is not Elizabeth. Happy Elizabeth. My name is Omeke Tolo. That's my name. Onyo Chona Zankej. Don't call me Elizabeth again. This Omeke Tolo has brought nothing but fortune to me. I've been making money with this name. Why do you want to change it? Mama, listen, if you continue to call me Elizabeth, I'll start seeing you as an enemy of progress. That is the truth. Omu bo Omeke Tolo. Ogu botar milie jishie. That is my name. Not Elizabeth. So, you have to cook fish pepper soup today. I'm craving it. I want to eat fish pepper soup. So let me go and buy fresh fish so you can cook it. I'm going to have to put it What I you say that you have to cook it. one year by the side. So keep this money for me. Ego, Chiyonu, Ego. Ome, Kita, Lopu, Pony, Ego. Ego, Chiyonu, Ego. That Elizabeth is going to grow into a monster, right? under your nose and you will have multiple reasons of ever stealing an innocent child. Mm -mm. They don't say that about my child. This is not good for me. Why is she like this? Why? Thank you so much for bringing me home. This is our house. I should be the one thanking you for accepting to come into my car and allowing me to bring you home. Uh, see you again some other time. All right. Um, are you not going to at least um, give me a bag? I'm sorry I can't do that. I have to go. I ask you now, you claim you're coming from church, right? Mom, that's the truth. I'm coming from the church. He... Yes! You see all these your lies and deserts? They will kill and bury you someday. Uh, hello, ma'am. Hi. Shut up and open that gate for me. I come up in my natural. Oh, my long in the day. My no more what you know, not joy. Can I can get me? Oh, one away. I just hope I have not created problem for this girl. 
What kind of a girl is this? She will enter the house without greeting. What is wrong with her? Oh, I can't see anything. Why do you like provoking somebody? Why do you seriously like joking with me? Why is the pepper soup I asked you to cook? If you cook that pepper soup by yourself, will your fingers chop off? Mama, please don't be a chameleon. Well, you're not the one that said I cannot cook. You said I don't know how to cook, so why are you asking me to cook the pepper soup? Because it is your pepper soup. And not mine. I have prepared what we are going to eat for dinner. If you don't want to eat what I prepared, go and prepare the pepper soup by yourself and enjoy it. Mama, why are you heartless? Can you be the way to me? Eh? I brought you the gnobi. You want that fish to waste? I bought that fish, 3,000 naira, that cat fish, that's how much I bought it. Do you want it to waste? You are ashamed of yourself. As a matter of fact, I pity the man that will marry you. When you cannot cook anything, cannot even organize yourself as a woman. Continue. I'm going to home training now. I'm going to respect. I'm going to respect, if not. Well, I'm trying so hard to understand what you're still doing here. Ma, I'm here because I know you still don't believe me. Sincerely speaking, I don't know him from Adams. I just saw him speaking with Father Leo and he volunteered to drop me off, that's all. Your explanation has no meaning to me. I'm sure you know I know you more than the way you think I know. I really do know you. You are a debased woman. Wearing the apparel or cloak of religion looking for some fools to deceive. Unfortunately for you, this lady is no fool. Ma, swearing is not good. But if that will work, I will swear on my life. I will swear to make you understand that I'm not lying to you. I don't know him. I do, like I told you, I just saw him. I, 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 I responded to him because I saw him with the Reverend Father. It's you, Kung, please. Hmm. All right. Mm hmm. Swear that he's not the one calling you. He's the one. Oh. But my means nothing. I don't have anything with him. Enough. I do not need your explanations anymore. Get out. Leave my presence at once. Hi, Ma, please. I don't want you to believe the worst of me. Please. We have nothing going on. I just met him. Mm. Right, I believe you. I believe you 1,005%. Now can you leave? <laughs>
Why does she not begin my call? Does it mean I'm calling at the wrong time or what? Oh, come on, Helen, come on. Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if I'm a man, I can't do it. Oh, well, I love Bala. Is it? Why are you calling me? I regret meeting you today. I regret entering your car. Oh, come on, baby. I cannot leave you alone. Oh, my love. Listen, I'm sorry, but don't you think you're sounding rather too tough? Why would you say anything like that? Ah, please, stop calling me your love. You should understand, at least you're close to the priest. Stop, please. I understand that your foster mother is making life unbearable for you at home, but I promise you one thing, tomorrow when I come there, all this will stop. You're not serious. What are you planning to do? All right, I'm planning to come to your house to look your foster mother in the eyes and tell her how much I love you and I want to make you my wife. <laughs> You've succeeded in making me smile. You must be a joker. I mean, how could you think of marrying me? Why not? Helen, I see in you everything I desire, everything I want. How can I go? This time when in you I find everything I want in a wife. Not to worry, when I come tomorrow you would understand better. Please don't come to this place tomorrow. I beg you in the name of God, don't. Well, I'm afraid Helen is too late. I am coming to your place tomorrow. Until then, good night my love. Good night. Hey, oh, I'm a... oh, yeah, come on, Oh, Neka Mutinke, oh, hey, here, Coco, here, here, I come on the Quanota. This girl can cook. How I wish I can cook something as tasty as this. Onye kulu manu me Kini kange mezi ay Ay Oh ame Akam Hey This thing Sweet Think I should add me let me add me inside this pepper soup. That's... Yes. One more bagu. Mm. One more bagu. One more bagu. What is it in cooking that I cannot do now? I've added everything, I've added that cow, I've added mama, everything. Why is this fish so sweet? Why? I'm going to make it all this year. Trouble on my baby, I'm going to shut up. Hey, this one 
spiritual teaching. Wow. Yeah, this one my belly is going to steal it. Wow. Yeah, while I know they finish a talk. Wow. <laughs> Trouble or not they finish a talk. Hello. Hello. This is John. I know why you stopped picking Michael's call. But I ask you. Do you think I will allow you to be free when I'm in trouble? It's impossible. Alright? John, listen to me. Okay? I have to be sincere with you. As we speak now, why I can't pick Michael's call is because I am already in a fix. In a fix? What do you mean by that? The money you gave to me is no longer with me. I gave all of it to my boyfriend and as it stands now, I don't know where he is. So what, what are you insinuating I do now? I should turn myself in because your boyfriend is on the run? Huh? No, I am just asking, I'm pleading that you give me time. Just little time so I can fix everything. Fix kill you dear. I overheard you talking with someone on the phone. Who? I don't understand you, mother. I'm I'm not supposed to talk to someone on the phone again. That's not an answer to my question. Who was that on the phone with you? Oh, one of my friends in school. Oh, what were you promising to fix? Minor things on campus. Uh, you know, your daughter is the lion in campus. I always fix things. I can fix things. All right, lioness. Are you aware that Helen has a boyfriend now who brings her home in his car? <laughs> It's not possible. Hmm. Helen doesn't have a boyfriend. <laughs> I mean, that is the last thing she would want to do. What I know is that you are still in her bondage of lies and deceit. I'm not. I want to tell you that I saw him today. Listen, Susan. I came to tell you that those are the kind of men you should be dating. Men that has something. I mean, men who can easily get a loan from bank because they have collateral. Those are the kind of men you should bring to my house and not those your jobless, jobless boyfriends. This is unbelievable. Mother, who told you I bring men to the house? Then you must be a fool to think I do not know what is going on around me. Listen to me. I'm not against you having men. Mm -mm. But all I'm saying is that if you must bring men to my house, then there must be men who have something over. She knows everything. That means she knows I sold part of her jewelry. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us now and to the hour of our third. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Father, Lord, I thank you. I worship you. I honor you. I bow down before your throne. I join the 24 elders to say that you alone are worthy of my praises. Father, I thank you for the life you've given me, for your protection, for divine security, for good health. The Bible says it is not of it that we let, but it is of the Lord that showeth mercy. The Bible says in all affairs of man, it can only be God. You have shown me that you love me. You have shown me that you care for me. I want to thank you for the life of my mother, the life of my sister, Susan. Father, Lord, I thank you. I give you all the glory because you've preserved us. I give you all the glory because you sent your angels. You promised us in Psalm 91 to always keep in charge of us. Even if we trample upon serpents and scorpions, ancient of days, you say it will never hurt us because of this I adore you and I say let your name be glorified in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Father Lord in any way we have sinned against you we all have come short of your glory. We ask for cleansing and purification. Do not use the sins against us. We ask for forgiveness of sins with some 51. We ask you, O Lord, to wash away our iniquities. Do not cast us away from your presence. Do not take your Holy Spirit away from us. Father, Lord, renew us. Make us whole again. Make us new again. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. This is Jeep, Jeep. This is a nice car. Yes, it's a nice car. For you to say this car is a nice car, it shows them a what's up. See, this is a millennial car. This car is more cheap car. Just 4,000 mileage, almost brand new. If we are to sell this car for money, maybe we'll sell it for like... 15, 12 million. Oh, 20 million. But we just want to do it. We just want to knock a salaka kabaza. We just want to do it. Give away. That's how we're selling it for 4 million. Give us 4 million naira and take the car. Just 4 million. No, see, see, this 4 million is cash. Yeah, I don't touch check. Bayan just de give de us 4 million and the car is yours. Money is not my problem. Yeah. Are you sure this car is not a stolen car? Okay, you can say. Now look at us now. Are we not responsible? Oh, now, no, no, don't look at me. Look at her now. Look at you. This, see, the papers and everything are intact. They are intact. The government will change your ownership in Abamoto. What? Yeah. You're sure? He we are certain, sure. Oga. So, Oga, I can give you guarantee. Uh, let me call. But I can write a uh, 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 change of ownership. Sign now our warrant. A uh, uh, one, four million. Mm -hmm. Very cheap. Let me call Thomas, my security. Let him bring the money. Okay, okay, okay. Thomas, that's it. Hippopotamus. 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 Chiniki. Trouble on my baby, Nisha. Jesus, Mama, where's the four million now? Oh, why did you wake me up now? Eh? See, 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 see the four million you wanted to give me. I'd already told you, Popotamus, to go and bring four million and give to me. Ije, Ije, Popotamus will bite your mouth. Look at the time. A girl at your register sleeping. God, why now? Why did you punish me with this kind of. Just shut up! Is this how you're going to behave in your own husband's house when you get married? Nah. And take care of your children or your husband? Nah. Mm. Hey. You are so shameless. Don't let me lay a curse on you. If you know what is good for you, go to the kitchen and Remove that poison in your cold fish and know what to do with it. Nonsense. No. Rubbish, you're dreaming of four million naira. You think it comes easy? Hey. 
Let's let me come and meet you. Hi. When the bon no Hey. Some people are just bad luck. Ninenim neike now, neike. Hi. Sapia. This one has spiritual teeth This one has telescopic ceiling While I know they finish at all Trouble or not they finish at all I'm making a lot of money Trouble with the for town this one spiritual This one while I know they finish at all Trouble or not they finish at all Chineke na ndewo Ndewo Chineke na ndewo Ime lao Chineke na ndewo What are you doing? I'm mopping the floor Are you supposed to be mopping rather than washing the dishes? If you must know, I've already washed the dishes. Liar. The plate with which I ate is still by my door. How could you say you've washed the dishes when that one is still there? Suzanne, I truly do not have a problem with cooking your meals and washing your dishes after eating. But I want you to know one thing. After enjoying the luxury of eating in your room, kindly do me a favor. Drop the plates back inside the kitchen so I can be able to wash it when I'm washing other plates. <laughs> That's not too much to ask. This is unbelievable. Who are you talking to in that manner? Who gave you the right to talk to me that way? What's going on here? Mother, can you imagine that this girl did not carry the plate with which I ate from my room? And when I came here to ask her why, she had the effrontery to tell me that I, sh I, sh I should have returned the plate to the kitchen after I used. Can you imagine the insult? Now, don't you think you are the one insulting yourself, this useless daughter of mine? Shame on you. Now listen, if you keep acting like this, as in if you keep behaving like this and end up living with me in this house, <laughs> I will make sure you regret every new day that breaks. It's a promise. It's yours. You see the kind of insult you bring into me. Mm? My own mother is now mad at me because of you. Who the hell do you think you are? Susan, I never said I'm anybody. I'm nobody. Allow me mop this place in peace, please. Okay. Be rest assured that I will deal with you in this house. You've always done that since we're kids. And I'm used to it. Okay. O tu o siri masi gichi neke. O tu o siri masi gichi yova o. I mama ya. My dear, the man confirmed that the four million naira we are talking about is not money. Nego, go, 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 go. 
Do you understand? He called his boy, Hippopo, to go and bring the money. Uzubo, Uzubo, my mother woke me up. Hello. What does Hello say? Ewu. Ewu, idiot. Your mother woke you up and you're angry. Ewu, Nala. Why are you angry with the woman who saved your life? Don't you understand? I said the money, the four million, he has already sent them to bring it. Do you know what we're looking for? And who did he send? Who did he send? He sent an hippopotamus. Hippopo! To go and bring money for me. Unala! Idiot! Do I look like hippopotamus to you? Unala! Unala! Listen, let me tell you. Let me just make it clear to you. Whenever you want to dream that don't send dream, don't get involved. Don't just talk! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Idiot! What do you ever bang? What do you ever bang? Don't just get involved with that nonsense dream. Anwa kwana anwa. Don't you dare call my dream nonsense dream. In a poala. Oh, na abago take na brain. Mo abo make it tolo. Ugu botar million di share. You have the nerve to call my dreams nonsense dream. Is this not what we've been looking for? No, I'm asking you. Is this not what we've been looking for? We managed to invoke a car. No get the ready to pay four million naira. You idiot. Na kaboche. We managed to invoke a car in your dream. Ewu. You are not there without me, so I mean that I'm going to get a little bit of a walk. Present yourself. Now, let me, let me just make it clear to you I will never succumb to that to a chest of people. Upon. It's not possible. What does this get to the money? You're going to get a little bit of a Let us. Let us continue with this, with the little way that we have been doing. By the time we mature in this magic business, <laughs> we can we can be invoking raw cash from banks. I'm telling you. Yes, raw cash. Yeah. Is that possible? Eh, uh, well, I I have not tried it, but I have not tried it yet, but I am thinking it will work. Those are the kind of things I want. I want to be coming to your head, not in sky, voting cars. Bah! Cars can be too risky for us for now. Eh? Don't you know that? I know like this now. now. By the time any bank comes to mind, wow, we'll just be like this, bar and invoke raw cash. Then, I'm telling you, then we'll, we'll buy any kind of car that we want. It will not become legitimate buying of a car. Not evoking. Oh, no, okay. no, 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 you're right. Huh? Hi. You're right. Police are not going to be able to get the money. They're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the money. You're not going to be able to get the why are you trying to change the discussion? And how can you call that fool? A fool like her, a lady. But she's a lady. How? Simply because my mother sends her to school. And please, she's not a family member. Calling her a family member is very insulting. She is overstepping her boundaries. And I have to chop her into pieces very soon. My dear. If you will listen to me, I will say you should avoid that girl and move on with your life. Move on, you say? How am I supposed to move on when she's literally become a bone around my neck? How is that possible? I mean, because she didn't serve you for a day, she has become a bone on your neck. How? Point of correction, Jessica. She hasn't served me for once. She's been serving my mom. And I think that is why her wings are so high. I will have to crush it very soon. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Oh. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you very much, madam. You're welcome. Wow. Thank you. <laughs> Come on. Uh. I must confess, I love your sense of dressing. <sighs> And your colon is simply out of the ordinary. <laughs> Thank you very much for all the unexpected compliments. Aww. Your words blew me sky high. <laughs> uh, all right. Are Thank you into fashion? 
Well, I am not into fashion. I'm actually into marbles. My father is the founder of Global Tableau Marbles, and presently, I am the one running it. Hold on. Global Tableau Marbles? Yes. It belongs to Chief Okwasa of Enochi. Right? <laughs> exactly. You know my father. Huh? I know him. Wonderful man. <laughs> my goodness. Please, pardon my manners. Thanks, come, sir. come, please. Thank come you. and sit down. Thank you. Just thank make yourself comfortable. Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, nah, guy, give him a message. Eh? I thought the, the man said he wants to do it. Oh, I'm not like that. Of course, he go away. Nah. I don't even know why he, he doesn't want to wait in our presence. Are you sure he has not run through the window with that gold? He's hmm. taking too much time now. No, 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 no. He cannot try it. I'm about to finish with him. Calm down. This man is a professional. I want to read the window. How do you make now? Nah, how? How? There are many other good meats in town. We came to you because we know that wisdom comes with age. Yes, and we see you as a father. As a father, we know you will tell us the truth, nothing but the truth. Yes. Well, thank you very much, my children. I have examined them. I've weighed them with my specialist skill. And uh, what I can tell you immediately is that they are pure gold. Pure gold. Pure gold. Pure gold. Pure gold. <laughs> we know. <I> told you. <laughs> we know, sir. Did you hear that, bro? We know, sir. You know, did you hear that? Oh, I told you that I know this pieces. We know, sir. He's our gold. <laughs> we know, sir. Uh, <laughs> so, sir. Uh, <clears throat> don't be offended. <laughs> Sorry, sir. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, sir. Ah. How much would you want to pay us for the good? Well, my children, I'm sorry I will disappoint you. Yes, because I don't have the kind of money required to buy such expensive golden jewelry. Hey. Oh yeah, oh yeah, children. Oh yeah. Um, Daddy, please, what do you think is the market value of these are gold? Yes, uh, like how about everything? Uh, everything would be uh, market value. Well, I must be honest with you. What you have in there, what's almost 15 million? <laughs> I, I hope you people do not steal these items from somewhere. Well, with all due respect, sir, this is an insult. I'm sorry about that. How could you say we stole anything? We are not thieves, sir. We are, we are legit people. Oh, we are legit people. I understand you, so I don't make a woo, but regardless, we are legit people. It's alright, it's alright, it's alright, my children. I'm sorry about that, but. As a father, let me advise you that gold is highly spiritual. It doesn't fade, neither does it die. Hmm? People with wisdom do not steal golden items because that singular act leads to regret always. I advise you that if you have stolen these items from someone, return them to that person before you begin to see problems. Hmm? Problems rising up.
to swallow you. I have a daughter named Susan. I mean, she's the one you should be looking at as your possible wife. The Helen you are asking after is not my daughter. She's just a girl living with us. Believe me, she has no class. I mean, such a guy coming from a wonderful family you came from shouldn't be asking after someone like Helen. I mean, it should be Susan. Yes. Um, I'm afraid, madam, I am not that kind of person that creates class difference among people. I ran into Helen in church. She possesses everything I want in a woman. I prayed over it and here I am, telling you that she has everything that I want. She is the one that I want to make my wife. Apart from the fact that you met um, Helen in your church, you don't even know much about her, do you? Come on, my late husband was a very close friend to your father. Believe me, he gained a lot. I have a duty as a mother to tell you the truth, which is what I'm doing. If you are looking for a wife that will give you peace of mind, Come on, it should be Susan, not Helen. True. All right. Where is this Susan? Oh, I will call her right away. Yes. <sighs> Hello, Susan. Come straight to the living room. All right, there. <laughs> Believe me, you will love her. She's coming. <laughs> I hope so. Oops. Here she comes. <laughs> Good afternoon, sir. Hey, Mom. Hi, Angel. You called. Ah, uh, yes, I. Wanted you to meet um, Mr. Jerry. He's the son of Chief Okwasa of Enoji and a very close friend of your dad. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. You look amazing. Thank you. <laughs> you look handsome too. I told you. <laughs> please sit. Sit, sit, please. Wow. See, 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 Uliwa. I once read in a book that all ghosts meet are sorcerers. With what that man said, all the guy. Nah, nah. I'm telling you the truth. It's like that book is right. God, what? Nah, nah. What nonsense? Nah. Don't tell me that you're bothered over that nonsense that the man said. I am bothered. Do you know the implication of what he said? My 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 friend, my journal. There are no implications. That man said that rubbish simply to scare us. Do you understand? See, 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 I am not scared. He cannot scare a man like me or do a possible. Why are you stubborn? Why have you refused to understand that this gold is not good for us? I put you I went on why. Let's return it now. Are you, are you mad? Are you mad? What's the problem? Fine. You want us to return them? How? No, no. How do we return them? Yeah? We invoked them by the power of the magic box from Akuleri. We don't know where they came from. Just like 
we don't know where all those things that we have been invoking came from. But even if we know where they came from, can you ever be stupid as to return 50 million? 50 million to somebody? Ch 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 50 million, 50 million. How certain are you? The man said 15 million. Are you sure it's truly 15 million? Make it alone. Don't provoke me. Why are you provoking me? Why are you provoking me now? Eh? You were there. We said, uh, 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 fine, let's go to somebody who is of, uh, who knows what God is all about. You, you were there when we talked about it. This man weighed it with his several years of experience in gold and said 50 million. Can you not hear that? Yeah? Can a man like that simply say something that he's not sure of? Okay, fine, fine. No, no. If I give you the privilege of, uh, if I leave the privilege of giving this, this, this dress, you will return it. You, 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 Invoke your mouth. Stop it up. Okay, match your gun. Every time I need to name you. Shut up your mouth. Invoke your white girl from from New Zealand. I'm a queen. I'm not the kind of people who can't nick. Guy, you may fall on it. London, Germany, everywhere. I'm not down on any way. We don't want to. We want to be a kid. So I go, I go. I get out. Guy, guy, what? Don't provoke me. If you, I, I, I can, I, I can do it now. If you provoke, I, 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 I can, I can invoke her now. I'm a kid. Oh, rubbish. I will I will I will invoke I will I will invoke 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 I Oh yeah, Kaiwana. Oh, Jerem, Jerem, Come again. Oh yeah, come, come. Nah. What we need? Yeah, no one's gonna make it. The other one ain't okay. Everything, Manchester, everything. Oh, 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 Don't. I don't. I don't. I, what is going on here? What happened to the jewelries? Michael, have I ever lied to you? Have I? I am telling you the truth, the only truth, that's what I'm telling you, alright? Like, I, I brought this bag from where I kept it, and behold, there was nothing in it. Huh? What, 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 what are you saying? You are you... Is, yeah, um, yeah. John, are you possibly telling me that the jewelries we bought for 7 million naira suddenly develop wings and fly out of the sea? The jewelries that we are making plans to sell for 13 to 15 million naira? Michael... I know it sounds silly and impossible to believe, but I'm telling you, that's that's how it happened. That's exactly what happened. When they listen, I think the the jewelry practically disappeared from the bag. I don't I don't know how it's I'm I'm I'm, I'm as surprised as you are. What kind of cock and booster is this? I need that jewelry. I need all this story now. I need this. Hey, Saloba. I will tell you the fact. I'm telling you the fact, and you're now claiming what I don't know. <laughs> Get ready to kill me, all. I'm telling you the truth, John. Get ready. I will be. I need this word. Is this? Get ready. Get ready to I kill me. Come on. I will be waiting. I need this more than that. See, now what do they talk about here, Ross? I'm, 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 I'm as surprised as you are. Well, madam, I must say, truthfully, your daughter Susan is. Very beautiful. Thank you very much. I told you. <laughs> I told you she's an angel. Believe me. <laughs> yes, and uh, 
speaking of an angel, she is very presentable, very, very presentable. And one who sees her for the very first time will know that she has an understanding of a good life. You just summed it. <laughs> Perfect understanding of the good life. Come on, is it not what every decent man wants in their wives? So, I need you to just make up your mind for Susan. Believe me, she's going to give you peace. Um, I... I'm afraid... I say things differently. How do you mean? Helen might not be as beautiful as your daughter, Susan. She might not wear expensive, dress expensive like girls of nowadays. But she is the one I want to spend the rest of my life with. I can see you've already made up your mind, you know, whom to marry. Believe me, I'm not going to stop you. Ah, thank you very much. God bless you for your understanding. I have a meeting to catch up. I believe we'll speak much later. All right then. Send my greetings to your daughter, Susan. What nonsense. That girl is your only child. So to know my age, it is your duty to bring her to order. But that's exactly what I'm doing. I am trying to raise my daughter as a responsible citizen of the world. But that girl wouldn't listen to me. She wouldn't even let me. She has become so wayward and almost uncontrollable. Just listen to yourself. Do not disappoint me. You are a strong woman. And it's only weak women that their children intimidate. Now I'm a Kaliam Bago, Opula a Kalonia Colia. Sa Opulo, Adi a Kali on your Colia. Hey, hey, Elizabeth! Elizabeth, come here! Come here. I think give you ever only from can't you greet? Me, or my kid Tolo? Am I the one you're referring to like that? Calling me like your husband, Elizabeth? Come here. Am I the one? Elizabeth, so you've lost your manners. You saw us sitting here. You got them? No greeting. Okay, make you go on. Greet you for what? No, what exactly do you want me to greet you for? Iburago? I'm asking you. Have you ever paid my bills? These clothes I'm wearing, are you the one that bought it for me? The answer is no. Have you ever given me 1,000? 50 kobo self, the answer is no. All you do is come to this house, sit, gossip, eat, and you're expecting me to greet you. Matukuru, tampotande wakadia keneg. Nonsense. Prosom ke, bacharanya go. Hey, this is bigger than what I thought. Is this what you finally became? Eh? Now, listen, listen, listen. Mind your business before I make you my business. I am warning you for the very last time. My name is Omeke Tolo. Ugu Water Mirage C. Not Elizabeth. I'm warning you for the last time. I'm the girl with the power. Ebumike. If you call me Elizabeth again, <laughs> I will give you trouble that is bigger than the kingdom where she reigns. What's going on now, you? Have you seen what I face every day? Hey, Nem, I feel your frustration. Are you sure she has not started smoking 
in band song dances. You see why I sent her to her prestigious Queen's College? But my daughter came out more wild, very wild, and disorganized, worse than those that attended our village schools. You see, son, is that? I have no plans whatsoever to interfere in the process of you selecting your wife. I've already discussed this with your mother, and I'm telling you now that you have my consent to go ahead and find your own wife. And any woman you settle for, as long as you find her yourself, it's okay by me. Thank you very much, Dad. But she must be decent, both at heart and the looks. Yes, because her personal object, if you settle for any of these girls nowadays, who are morally bankrupt. Yes. In that, I completely agree with your mother. In as much as I have given you the consent, of this family for you to go and find your own wife yourself does not mean we are going to allow you drag the name of this family in the mud by bringing in a woman who is not morally upright dad and mom i am not god i cannot see the hearts of man one thing i'll show you both is that the woman in question is an angel you would definitely love good <laughs> and where is she from no, beautiful wife of mine, we shouldn't be asking him that. You know, wherever his wife is coming from shouldn't be our concern. I personally believe that a good wife can come from anywhere. All right. You have my consent. Go ahead and invite her over. I'm not going to say anything until I have interacted with her, until I've seen her one-on-one. -on -one. Then I'll be able to make up my own mind. Thank you very much, Dad. You're the best. Mom, thank you. Uh, Dad, I assure you one thing. You will definitely love her. <laughs> I like the sound of that. <laughs> Guess what, baby? I'm not good at guess. Tell me what it is. Right now. I discussed with my parents about us and they are so excited. <laughs> excited? About what? Why should they be excited? They've never met me. They don't even know the kind of person I am. Ah, oh, come on. You know what, darling? Just get ready tomorrow. I'll come pick you so you can meet with my parents. Pick me and take me to where? My parents would love to meet you. Please don't be angry with me over what I want to say, but I wouldn't want to follow you to your parents. Oh, come on, darling. My parents are not teamy. They are well-lettered and traveled coupled, which means they would not interfere in the process of me selecting a wife. They will support any woman that I present, and you, my love, I choose to present to my family. Listen, Jerry. I know nothing about you. I just met you. Apart from the things you told me about you, I do not have a glimpse of who you are. Of course you said you want to marry me. And I haven't said anything. How could you possibly fix an appointment with your parents and you want me there? Come on, love. When a man falls in love, he does not waste time to make the woman his. I'm in a hurry because of what I see in you. In you, I see the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. With all due respect, Jerry, I'm sorry. I wouldn't want to continue with this discussion. I gotta go. Ali? Trouble, 
yourself to be a better person. Huh? Eh, hey, because you know what's going to get yours. Eh? Do you want to embarrass yourself? As you can see, I was here joyfully exercising before you rudely interrupted me. Mm. Please allow me to continue with my exercise. <laughs> Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Mommy. He convinced me beyond reasonable doubt that he wants to marry you. So why are you giving the young man a negative attitude? He spoke to you about it. That's not good. What do you know about good? If you knew about good, you would have listened to the young man. Do you think suitors like that are easy to come by? I know I'll definitely get married someday, but I just want to do it my own way. Now you listen to me. You do not have a say on this anymore. Okay? I have already instructed my boutique to get you something to wear tomorrow. And that's it. Something to wear for? He's bringing his parents over to see you. Why is he bringing his parents to our house? That's because you refused to follow him to go see his parents. Now he has decided to bring his parents to come and see you. Now listen to me, you have to prepare your mind to see his parents tomorrow. That's fine. Why am I resisting this guy? Father Liu told me already that he's a nice guy who will love his wife. Why am I resisting him? Come on, baby. You're my one and only, and you know I love you so much. Listen, Jerry, I'm so livid right now. Why, why are you doing this to me? What kind of impression are you creating about me, your parents? My love, come on, why, why are you sounding so tough? You know me, I, didn't, I wouldn't do a thing like that. Come on, that, that, that's strong. Why, why would you, you sound so tough? What did I do? My mother told me you told your parents to come to the house because I refused to come and meet them. Why? Do you know what you're doing to my personality? It's not nice. Oh, you claim you love me. But, but, but look at what you're doing to me. Come on, darling. I wouldn't do anything like that. Your mother told you that to make you feel bad. You know very well that I wouldn't do a thing to hurt you. Okay, now I'm ready to correct this impression. I'm ready to go see them tomorrow when I come in to pick me. I'm afraid, my love, it's too late. My parents already made plans to come see you tomorrow. It's not about, it's not about you. It's not what you said because I didn't tell them anything. It's about what I made them believe and I convinced them that we should come see you. And they agreed, so that's it. 
I feel so bad right now. I feel terrible. Oh, come on, darling. You shouldn't feel so bad. Please. All I need you to do is rest your head, relax, and expect my parents and I tomorrow. Bye. Good night. Good night, my love. I love you. I am not going to say much, but that Jerry guy is just very okay. Very okay for the one he came for. Or the one throwing her chips safe at him. What is wrong with you? Hmm? Jessica, what is wrong with you? Do, do you want me to slap you before you start minding your choice of words? I've not said anything wrong. I'm only telling you the truth. What stupid truth? Eh? Listen, if you continue this way, I'll stop letting you know things about me. You know it yourself, Susan, that if not for my constant advice to you, you will be committing blunder every day. Blunder? As what? Are you trying to insinuate that, that you are more intelligent than I am? Hmm? I'm not going to argue with you on this, Susan. But if you feel it's right to throw yourself at the man that came for your sister, go ahead. She's not my sister. Simple. Okay. Suit yourself. Meanwhile, what do you want me to offer you? After blabbing your mouth. Mm. Oh. <laughs> what is the matter with you? What did you hold? Ma, I know this dress may be very expensive. Very expensive. I don't like it. I look so indecent. I've never dressed like this all my life. The hair, the lashes, the, the gum, everything is looking odd. You've never dressed like this all your life, yes. That's because you are a high class and wakey. You know nothing about fashion. Now listen to me. I know that family too well. Didn't you see Jerry? They are into fashion. Now listen to me. If you want to win that family today, you must compose yourself in the stress I gave you. Come on, let's move. I still feel old. Like I said, I'm not comfortable. Can you do less of the scrap and move with me? Okay. And now you listen to me. You see that gum in your mouth? You have to look at them eyeball to eyeball and you chew it. That's all. Come. Son, you know I am doing this because of you. I know that. Trust me, you are going to like her. <laughs> well, we are here. We are waiting. <laughs> I'm glad you came. Madam, meet my daughter, Helen. <laughs> Helen, this is Chief Okwasa of Inwadi. And that's his beautiful wife. They've come to see you. And I have no doubt in my heart that they are already in love with what they're seeing. Welcome. Mm. Um, uh, excuse me, Helen. Can I, can I see you briefly, please? Thank you. Oh, come on, Jerry. Not so fast. That's not a wise thing to do. Allow your parents to admire your wife to be. Uh, Marashiamaka is your name, right? Yes, Chief. Well, I have seen your daughter. And needless to tell you that I have come to the end of my stay here. 
you will hear from me. Okay? Oh, come on, Chief, please. No, 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 Chief, please. Not so fast. Not so fast. I prepared a very delicious okwa for you people. Talk to your parents. No. The table is set. It's set already. Come here. Chief, meet my daughter, Susan. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon, my dear. Your daughter is very full. Oh, oh my god. Oh, hi. Thank you. Okay then. Chief? I'm a wonder. I have to take my leave now. You too? How about the Okwa? Why don't you call your parents back? Helen? Excuse me for a moment. It's alright. Why am I so unfortunate? No, I really don't understand this. I just don't understand this. No matter what, you owe me some explanations. What is this? Listen, you owe me an explanation. You need to tell me why you're dressed like this on the day I am coming with my parents to see you. I'm sorry. Believe me, this is not me. I've never dressed like this. This is not even my clothes. This is the first time I'm ever dressing this way. Can you listen to yourself? I mean, can you hear yourself speak at all? So you did this to spite me? To provoke my parents or what? No, my mother bought this clothes for me. I've never dressed like this like I told you. I insisted, I objected, but she said no that she wait. I don't know what she's up to. <laughs> Why am I so unfortunate? Why is that? Now listen to me, Susan. You are the reason I am involved in this manipulation in the first place. So I would like you to capitalize on this to win that family. Mother, are you trying to say that you planned all of this from the start? To make them hate Helen and have interest in me? Don't be a fool. I know I'm your mother quite all right. But I'm not going to do everything for you. Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hate? Uh, now, Jerry, you listen to me. If you have parted ways with your manners, I'm telling you here and now to go back to the trash basket where you left your manners and pick it up. What the hell is wrong with you? Oh, Father, can you do me a favor, please? Say calm. Calm down. What you saw out there is to make you hate the girl. Now, what do you mean by that? Mom, Helen doesn't own that kind of clothes. She doesn't wear that kind of clothes. It was Madame Chemaka that bought that clothes and forced her to wear it earlier today. I don't understand. Why in this world will a woman do a thing like that? Reasons best known to her. You see the other girl she introduced as Susan Perhaps that's her biological daughter. That's the one she wants me to marry. And when I said no, she put up those things to make you hate the girl. Helen is not like that. I know her very well. If I am asked to say, that Susa is better than the one you are lusting after. That is exactly what she wanted to achieve. That you say Susan is the one best for me, but that's not it. Susan is not who she portrayed herself to be. Helen is. Helen is a good girl, mom. I know her too well. Everything you saw earlier today was Madame Chemaka's script. She played it all out for you to hate Helen. She's, Father, believe me, Helen is a good girl. You like her. Well, uh, somehow, I think I am beginning to put one and the two together. I think I have an idea where this is uh, possibly coming from and uh, where it may likely be going. But you see, Jerry, eh? I am not going to believe anything you are saying until you prove it. You have to prove it. All right, tell me, Father. How else do you want me to prove this to you? Why am I so Don't ever think of leaving the house. Your father will be mad at you wherever he is. I I am happy that you are you know the importance of prayers. 
Just continue praying to God and He will direct your path. Hmm? One day you will become a graduate. And once that is done, you will know the reason I told you that your future is bright. My father cannot blame me for living now. Because this house is now programmed to bring me sorrows and sadness. Can you tell me what happened to my jewelry? What jewelry is, ma? I don't understand. Helen, I've always known you to be a thief. I have always condoned all your excesses because of your father. But does it mean you do not have a limit, dear? How could you steal my Juries worth almost 20 million naira. Jesus. What are you going to do with them? Ma. I, I did not steal any jewelries. I, I don't know what you're talking about. I've never stolen all my life. I didn't see your jewelries. I never touched any jewelries. Look at me now, Ma. I don't wear jewelry. Oh, shut up. What do you think you're doing? Playing smart with me? Ma, sincerely speaking, I did not see your jewels. I've never touched them. It's your go. Why am I so... Do you know the worth of the jewelries you stole? Any jewelries, that's the truth. I did not. Hey, Jesus. You Jesus. must be stupid. Now, for the last time, where did you keep the jewelries? I did not. Where did you keep the jewelries? I did not steal any jewelries. Really? Where, where did you keep the jewelries? Speak! Provide those jewels. I did not steal any jewels. Keep quiet! God. Surprised at you. What do you mean? You know what I'm saying. This guy has never been there. He just came into the picture, and from what I know, he has never asked you out. And that is because that witch has not given him the opportunity to make a decision of his own. She has kept him somewhere, and the fact that he cannot do anything is killing me slowly. Should I tell you the truth? What? You are sick. Yes. Jessica, have I not told you to mind your choice of words towards me? Oh, don't play that sentiment card with me, for you know it's not going to work. I'm telling you the truth. He found her, fell in love with her. Why must you bring in your witchcraft into this? Do you know his father? Do you know the kind of businesses he runs? If not for witchcraft, what will make a handsome looking guy of his status to talk to a low life classless I wanna be Helen? Love. Love, my dear. That is no love. He doesn't love her. He does love me. You know, if you continue saying this, if you continue talking like this, I will stop welcoming you into my house. Hey! Hmm? 
baby. Oh, my God, baby. Oh, you are. When are you ever going to say this to me? When are you planning to tell me something that will gladden my heart and my soul? When am I planning to, to say what? Yeah. <laughs> when am I planning to say what, my baby? My walking. No, tell me. I'm still waiting on for the day you will use this your idiot mouth to thank God for granting you access to my life. An angel like me. Do you think it's easy to get me? You're not this. No, I, I can't believe this. Have you gone bonkers? I don't understand. What do you mean? Are you mad? How can you call my mouth an idiot mouth? Is you, 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 are you stupid? How in this world will you refer to yourself as an angel? Angel in the Which angel? Angel from where? Are you so walk up idiot? Zukwanike. You are Zukwanike. You are walking here. We are in public, Oriwa. We are in public. You can never be romantic. Imagine not that romantic. Oh, 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 oh. Idiot. Wonder why you should open this? You are not sense. It is your mouth that you are you, supposed to call an idiot mouth. You open your mouth to insult me. Huh? Huh? It's time to die. Don't worry. I, I, I will deal with you. Idiot. Get away, guys. Idiot. Hey, what? Oh, yeah, Wesley, wake up. You can't wait, wait, excuse me. You know, well, after, after, after calling my mouth, you're an idiot. You see, I'm going to go, 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 get, get out, idiot. Get, get out, get, 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 get out here. Yeah. Let, 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 you make it all that you have. It is me that that tell me that name. You make it all. Now I'm saying, now I'm saying, you are the one. Respect, respect yourself. Don't worry, I will deal with you. You make it all.
that I'm hanging out with you and you misbehave the way you did today. Mbawa, I'll piss you. Idiot. Sorry, sorry now, eh? Butuo. Sorry, just butuo. I promise you won't happen again. Sorry. Eh, who? Uzo now, guy. Ndo. Ndo now. That nonsense again. Are you stupid? Are you, are you mad? Which which vein did you touch? Which of the veins did you touch? I yeah, yeah, did you touch? What you mean by you owe me spirit, soul, and body in Apuala? Oh, is it because I'm messing with you? Oh, get along. This is going your part. Oh, now you know it's a gun, right? Now you know it's a gun. When you were pointing it at me, you didn't know it's a gun. Now listen and listen good. You have lost. You are a loser. Look at you. Unyala. I've planned on how to give it to you this night. The way you never had it. And if work will go up. Mm. Next time you try this nonsense with me, <laughs> you will see me. Rubbish. Please, please. Please. Hi, my dear. Please come. Please come. Come. Hi. My baby, uh -huh. my everything, my investment, and please, <laughs> don't go. I, I will, don't go, please. Oh, yeah, spend the night here. Oh, uh, he said, yeah, you yeah, have decided to give it to me. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Asking as if you don't know where she is. What is that supposed to mean? Where is she? Helen is sleeping. Sleeping? By this time? Mother, that fool is sleeping in there because we are tolerating her a lot. And in the process, she's becoming so lazy. Honestly, mother, I will tell you this is your fault. Now go and call her for me. I'm to letting her that much. I don't get it. How am I to letting her too much? <laughs> It is clear to me that Barry hates me. I don't know why he hates me so much. 
But I will not continue to remain here for him to always hit me like a slave. I am sure I will find someone out there who will see me as a harmless woman that would not be accused of stealing. I lived a noble life here, and God in heaven is my witness. Even if I must be suspected for everything, I should not be accused of stealing, for I have never stolen all my life. I wish to thank you for all you did for me right from when I lost my parents. You did well. I am sure God will reward you. But I am gone. Gone in search of someone who will not beat me like a common criminal or allow someone else to do the same to me. This is funny. Where did she go to? How could she leave? <laughs> She leave her phone off up to the side. Madam, I was unable to make out anything you told me over the phone, so I decided to come in person. Where is Helen? Because I've been calling her phone and it's not reachable. Here. She left this note. She stole my jewelries, bought almost 20 million naira, and absconded. That's impossible. Huh. It is clear to me that Barry hates me. I don't know why he hates me so much. But I will not continue to remain here for him to always hit me like a slave. I am sure I will find someone out there who will see me as a harmless woman that would not be accused of stealing. I lived a noble life here and God in heaven is my witness. Even if I must be suspected for everything, I should not be accused of stealing for I have never stolen all my life. I wish to thank you for all you did for me right from when I lost my parents. You did well. I am sure God will reward you. But I am gone. Gone in search of someone who will not beat me like a common criminal or allow someone else to do the same to me. Madam, with all due respect, Helen will never Ever still anything? How much more your jewelries? I beg your pardon. Do you live here with us? I mean, how would you reach such a ridiculous conclusion when you don't even know what is happening here? Who is the Barry that takes so much joy in beating up women? Who is there? Why are you asking about my brother when you have not even said anything about my missing jewelry? It doesn't mean anything to you? to inflict her with so much wickedness. Why? What is this? Drop on the death for town. I'm making a lot of you. 
Come out now, come out, it's me. I know you are in there, you are listening to me and you know what I'm saying. Come out. Baby, get, 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 See, 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 I met your mother on her way out and she told me that you are here. So I miss me here, just come out. Come out now. Nah, just come out now, open this door now, beg. Forget about what happened yesterday. Forget about what happened yesterday. is here. Chero, 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 Makito. Don't tell me that you are still sleeping. Yeah, look, look at, look at, look at. Almost 11 o'clock in the morning and you are still sleeping. Don't tell me this is what you are going to do when we when I finally marry you. Hey, 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 Gigi Eba. When you finally marry who? Me. Omeketolo. Tolo. Ogo Botar Mirye Gigi. You, you marry me. What do you really? See, don't even provoke me. Don't even provoke me because if you do, I will remind you of your fuck up yesterday. Say why you're here. If not, I'm going back to sleep. And when one time, Robbie, you should be gone. Those who refused to agree, we eventually agree. And when they finally agree, they will agree more than those who agreed for the beginning. You're not serious. The car. Which car? I now confirmed what the ghost meet said about those jewelries. That those jewelries are evil. I now use the powers of Ebuluja, Ebuluna to invoke them back to where they came from. So the your suggestion of a car is what on them what came to mind. So I want us to face it. I face here, we You mean you want to invoke the car? That is why I'm here. That's why I'm here. Listen, I have perfected plans to invoke a particular car. But the problem is that I don't know how to drive. Do you understand? You are the original criminal who has been driving. Hey, 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 shut up. Did you just call me a criminal? Hello, <laughs> make it hello. Both of us are criminals. So you don't need to flare up for nothing. You understand? Listen, I am going to invoke a car today. So go inside, dress up, let's start something. <laughs> Let me freshen up. Okay. <laughs> hey! Uh, open now. Why are you doing this? Open now. It is just you and I. Take it and watch this motor. Oh, make it all. I have perfected the plans of the car now. From, from here. We will now go out for the car. Trouble on my Trouble for town. This one a spiritual This one a As you can see, Inspector, this is the house. The owner of the house has uh, built another house in Inagua, and that's where he has relocated to, and he's retired. But he has, and however, he has given me the mandate to sell off this property. He took it. I never doubt you. I just needed to be sure of what we are doing. Well, it's a very nice property, um, and I can assure you, we will enjoy the property. Okay. Yeah, strike you, right? Yes, we can go in and check, check the property. Okay. Let's go. Did you see anything? What? <laughs> Hi! What, what for? 
Hold this thing, now. You don't have to watch for two. What do you want me to do with this? This is the magic key that they sent inside the box. He can move any car. So move this car. That would amount to car theft. That's not what you promised me, Naga. In car is The important thing is that we're living with this car. Nana, nah, see, this is Toyota Corolla. Akaroko. Hotakara. We can sell it. Nah, 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 the wonder of Arabo. Snake, move this car. What's that, okay? What are you doing? This is the wonder of Arabo. Oh, <laughs> 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 Come on, you are the, yeah, 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 the original criminal. Yeah, 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 the original criminal. I told you I can drive. I, I didn't know. I, I, I was even thinking you. Uh, it's one of those you are not safe talk. Uh, you oh, can yeah. drive. Again. You have seen it. It is that that I know that you can drive. Oh, no, one. Come on, make it on. Oh, no, one. Oh, yes, sir. Come on, no, one. Oh, no, one. Yeah, I think it's a nice place. Uh, yes, it's a very nice place. The owner has given me full mandate to sell off this property as soon as possible. It's a nice house. Um, you will enjoy the house. So we can strike you, right? Um, let's go to my office. Let's um, let's continue the deal. Inspector, where's your car? This is where I park my car. I have the keys in my hand, Inspector. Are you serious? I bought it here. I bought the car here. I can't find my car. I can't find my car again. Hey! Hey! Oh, the go 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 See, this guy is almost brand new. See the movements now, very fast. Very fast movement, too. Yes, now. And we're going to sell it fast. Akaroko. No, 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 no. See, see, see. See, see I suggest we repent it and start enjoying it just the way we're enjoying it now. Hey. 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 King just now, yeah, just don't know. Don't know. Don't know. They don't know us, we don't know them. <laughs> you know them all, like, close range now. Just give them that, that like 15 years. Huh. See, here, let me tell you. Here. Yeah. We have the whole of today to drive this car. Do you understand? Mm. By tomorrow, I will now uh, uh, make a decision of what will become of the car. Mm. Follow you, follow you, follow you. Follow you, follow you, follow you, follow you, follow you, follow you, follow you. I know the who all this one. I know the, 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 the Are you sure they will not catch us? Who will catch us? Who will catch us? We are uncatchable. <laughs> With the magic boss from Abilene. Bad on voice, it's supposed to be very straight. Get with him. But yeah. But yeah. Now I know that you are the original criminal. Make it happen to the dead. Just go straight, straight. Look. Go, go. Yes. If you get me, you get Take your left. Eh, left now. Get away, left, left, left. Just only left. Here the police are, ba. I'm telling you. It's in Babu. What do I want to do? 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 What do I want to
the, the guy will go another left. Eh. Wait, when you get to the junction, you take left. Eh. I know this area. Oh, my area, Coco. Why you want to be? Officer, I just want to believe that this is but a dream, officer. This is what we have been experiencing at this time. Things are just disappearing from where they have been kept. And no one has been able to find an explanation to that. Yes, sir. We are talking about a car. A full car. A fully registered car. Officer, this is the keys. You cannot use tell me that my car disappeared without somebody stealing the car, officer. I agree with you. That is why we have sent our radio messages to all our police channels. I assure you, our patrol officers will get the culprit. Officer, why is this happening to me, officer? This is a car I bought just barely one month. And I installed all security gadgets in it. It's all right. Like I said, I assure you, our patrol officers will get it. Okay? <sighs> just take it easy. Hello? This is Barista Giwa, the administrator of the estate of late Mr. Paulson. How are you, Madam Chiamaka? Very well, Barrister. You haven't called in years. Is everything all right? The principal part of justice administration is here the other side. Helen called me and I'm not happy with what she told me, so I'm calling to hear from you before I make up my mind. <laughs> what did she tell you? That you accused her of stealing your jewelries and you told your brother to beat her up like a common criminal. Are you possibly holding brief for her? Hold on, are you trying to say that she wasn't the one who stole my jewelry? What I make from you so far is that you accuse her for sure and also told your brother to beat her up. Do I need to tell you that I'm disappointed? <laughs> your disappointment is none of my business, Barrister. Are you aware that she is no longer living in my house? I'm not aware of that. She didn't tell me. Oh, that's to tell you the kind of person you are defending. This girl absconded from my house. Believing that she could make a living from selling my jewelry. Now you listen to me, Barrister. I do not know how she managed to get you online. I want you to go back to her that way because ever since she left this house, her line has been off. Now you go back to her that same way and tell her to return all my jewelry. <laughs> she doesn't know who she's messing with. Chiamaka, I am convinced that Helen didn't steal your jewelry. Well, I am convinced that she stole them. I want you to understand there are ladies and there are ladies. I am one of those ladies that you cannot steal their, their properties and go scot-free. Barrister, those things she stole from me will continue to haunt her for the rest of her life. Nonsense. Why am I having this feeling that she's one of those evil ladies that belongs to secret society? So unfortunate. Why is everyone hate? Joe. I, I, I don't understand what is happening here. Where did the disappeared jewelries come from? Michael. Hmm? This is a mystery I cannot explain. Is it not this morning I heard a strange noise coming out from my room? So I rushed in to know what's, what's going on there. As I got in, I saw the, the box shaking, like shaking heavily. Hmm? After a while, the box normalized. So I, I went and opened it. Guess what I saw? I saw the jewelry. Everything is here, isn't that? Everything is here. Everything is here. In fact, everything is here. One, Odo. 
this is not a good sign. It is possibly we have landed ourselves in a big problem. One do. What do we do now? Is that not why I called you here? I am I am I am totally disconnected. That's why I called you. I don't even know what is happening. So tell me, what do we do? What are we going to do? I'm confused. I've not seen this kind of thing before. I mean, in my life, in my entire life, I've not seen this appearing and appearing. I'm not going to do You do not question God. God knows all things. Just continue living with Madame Chiamaka and pray to God that he will reveal the way forward. That's all I can tell you is that your future is bright. I am sorry, Barista, but I can't continue living where I am not needed. Ojo, oh, yes, ma. Do you know what I am going to do? What? I will lure him into a lonely place and forget this dagger in his stomach. That's going to the extreme, man. I'm not going to that. I'm already standing at your gates and I came prepared. Inania. How do you mean? You're where? Listen, I came alone and I know why. Your gate is locked. Come and open this gate now before we before when I damage everything here now. You think I'm joking? No, you think. You think I believe you, you man. Calm down, you're shouting. What's the meaning of this? Why are you here? My friend, I want my money. Oh, God, this is not happening. How could you come here? Do you want to put me into trouble? No, 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 no. Don't tell me about yourself. I'm already in trouble. Let me have my money back or I will show you the mafia in me. You're shouting. Can you calm down? You're shouting. I'm shouting. You... I'm shouting. What is this? What's going on here? Who are you, young man? Madam, my name is Michael. Susan here sold a large quantity of jewels <gasps> to us. And we have already paid her 4 million naira. Now we have confirmed that the jewels are more than jewels. And I'm here with what I got from her. I want to turn it back to her. I want my money back. I'm no longer interested in the business. Did you hear what I said? Susan, Jesus Christ. So, you are the thief who made away with my jewelry. Mother. Oh, Jesus. Why are you listening to this miscreant? I have not seen him before. What are you talking about? Uh, madam, what I bought from her is here. Like I said, we have already paid her four million naira. Remaining three million naira balance as it stands. I'm no longer interested. I want my money back. So where is the money they gave you? I'm asking you. Madam, 
I am still acting calm because you are now involved in this case. Yes. Susan here is very small. I want my money back in peace. Else, I'm going to be at the here. Madam, many years ago, I accompanied you. Calm down. Calm down, mister. Please. I'm the owner of the jewelry. Please. I'm glad you brought them back, okay? Now, please, can I have them? I will pay you back your four million naira. Bam, 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 bam. I don't work that way. I will not say hello. Madam, I need my money, cash, and I will give you back your I said, all right. I will give you your money. Let me have my jewelry. Madam, I, I don't work that way. I need, I need my money. I need my money back, then I will give you back your property. Right. Have you seen your life? How many more people must you kill before you stop? Ojo. Ojo, you know it's not my fault. I didn't kill her. She no need to wake her and the driver hit her. Who pursued her to the car? Are you not the one? The innocent girl ran away and still you pursued her. Come on, Ojo. How, why are you blaming me for that? Must you blame me? I wanted to enjoy free babe. Don't you get it? Okay, I got Now that you have pursued her to her death, her blood will be on your head. It is between me and God. Eh? Where exactly did you see her? Along the road that leads to uh, Valley's fish pond. She was lying on the on the on the road, helplessly. And there was nobody there to help her. When I got close, I saw that she is your daughter, so I decided to bring her back. Oh, I, don't, I don't know how to thank you. Eh? This boy is follow you with this story, huh? Yes, you will listen to me. Arisa, thank you so much. Okay. Um, I think she needs rest. I know. So, I will take my leave now. Thank you very much. Okay. Anytime you need help, somebody will be available to grant you help. Amen. Amen. For helping my daughter. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Please take care of her. Amen. Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if a moment I can't do it, oh, well, I don't want to do Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if a moment I can't do it, oh, well, I don't want Now, eh? Yeah. I think we should do what I suggested earlier. I think we should just repaint it and start enjoying it. Yeah. Start driving the car here now. Hey. And then check it along. Mm -hmm. Oh, make it along. Can you not see now that you are the original <laughs> criminal? Look at the way you are driving the car. Fa, 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 fa. <laughs> okay, hey. no problem. That will be on the condition that you have become my wife, and there's no going back. Yes, that's one. That's where we will not paint the car, and then it will not become our own. Stop, stop, stop. Can those here go? You see this my fresh body that you are enjoying. Natural everything that you are enjoying on a platter of gold. Be contented with it. Forget it. I will never be your wife. Forget marriage. Forget marriage. Then you'll never be my wife. Hey, 
you. Never be your wife. No worries. I will shock you. I'm telling you, I will shock you. I will shock you when the time comes. More, I will never have a guy at home can walk. Eh, no problem. No Remember, I just go with the car so that uh, it will make your movement easier. Eh? Hey! Uh, Are you serious? You're such a darling. No, 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 the box of magic is in the car. Do you understand? Mm. Uh, just go with it. Uh, but let me go. Don't try nonsense with it. Too. Don't just go to try your luck with it. In my absence, you will go mad. Please, you want to try it. I don't want it. Come have... and carry it. Biko, 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 biko. No, 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 no. That car is now our office. Do you understand? Let the boss be in the office. Uh, okay. Be very careful. Though. No problem. Uh, one campier one. Eh, Oh, my lord, this girl will finish me. This girl will keep you. Hi! We got the boy here. Oh, my lord, this girl will keep you. Uncle. You cannot be making case for Susan because you did not even know what Susan did. As we speak, she's not even at home. And I don't care. <laughs> she's just a common thief. I'm sure she's with her stupid boyfriend. Hey, but uncle, let me shock you. I am going to arrest him. And I will teach him the biggest lesson of his life. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry I have to cut this call on you, Uncle. Please. <laughs> This one has spiritual teeth This one not the finish at all. Trouble on the finish at Officer, officer, well done. Officer, well done. No. Uh, good afternoon, brother. Can That's... I see your particulars? My particulars? Yes. Ah, officer, are you there now? Uh, let, me, let me take a look. Uh, okay, make I clear where this place is no good. Okay, officer, let me let me park well now. Uh -huh. I, I they block Clever people. Enough. I'm not sure. Clever Clever enough. Enough.
Check that photo. Officer, check that photo, check that photo. They are not here. They are not here. Over, check that photo, check that photo, check that photo. Check the papa, sir. Policemen were chasing. Yes, they thought I'm a thief. They wanted to arrest me. <sighs> All right, come to the front. No, just move, please. I said, come to the front. They won't see you. Can you just no, come? No, no, no. Just move the car. Come to the front. No, move, please now. Helen, come to the front. Helen. <laughs> I was getting worried. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Where am I? You're home. You're home. How did I get here? It's a long story. Don't worry. Ah. <laughs> How are you feeling now? Hmm? I'm still weak. But like the priest would always say, let the weak say I am strong. I am strong. Hey, I am happy you're talking about the priest. Oh, yeah, please let me help you so that you, I, I can help you go take your shower and come and eat. Right? <laughs> Nah, man. This guy is cute. This cute guy is mistaking me for someone else. I must play along. But who is the person? Why are you staring at me? Don't you want to go home? When Anchemaka has called me that you're not a thief, Susan is the thief. She'll do anything to have you back home. As a matter of fact, she will be delighted to have you back home. How possible? No, tell me, if you were me, will you do what you're asking me to do? Come on, darling. It's a new dawn. The whole mischief, manipulation has been unmaxed. Even my parents have asked me to proceed in getting married to you. But it cannot come to pass. It can't work when you're running. The police think you're a public nuisance, but no, it's not you. It's Susan. Even the people who did this to you, the people who chased you out, wants you to come back home. You've got to come back home. Do do anything to have you back home. You have to go back home. Who is this Elizabeth that looks just like me? Is there something going on in my life that I don't know? Hi, 
Fini. Hmm? Sorry. Oh. Yeah. I want you to drink this one. Oh. It will help you regain your strength. Oh. Take a shower and rest. Oh. I'm happy you have understood that that loser Olimwa is not good for you. He doesn't deserve an angel like you. Eh? He's a failure. You don't need him anywhere around you. Yes. Enjoy, oh. Enjoy. Let me go and arrange something for you to uh, uh, shower when you finish. Oh. Thank you, ma. You're the best. You're welcome. Huh? I'm happy you have realized that I'm the best thing that happened to you in your life. I'm sure they'll be delighted to have you back home. This is the opulence of the GRA. Hi. I love this. <sighs> yes, and I'd like to say thank you to you. Uh, I really appreciate it. Oh, come on. You don't have to. Oh, sorry. I mean, I'm still that old Jerry, the one that has always loved you. I... Shall we? Oh, yes. <laughs> 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 yes, I know. <laughs> this one? Yes, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Off to the chapel for prayers. What? Yes, ma, but I won't stay long. I'll be back soon. Hey, that's so nice. Go and kiss my child. All right, ma. May God bless you. Amen. Hey. I can see everything turning around, everything turning around, everything turning around for my good. And I'm a free and in a corner to hurry. If any neck on a to hurry, if any neck on a to hurry, my God, ma'am. Ah! God, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, my Lord, you can't get out. My why am I so of 
Excuse me, please. Good afternoon. I'm new in this area. Could you please tell me where I can find a Catholic church around here? There's one down there. Oh, really? Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Could she be real? We need to show you by this time. Yeah. Oh. Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Please, I know you'll find it difficult to believe me, but honestly speaking, I am sorry, deeply sorry. I realize that I've not been a good mother that I should be to you. I am sorry. Did you know that the people Susan sold my jewelries to return them? Oh yes, they did. And I paid them the exact amount which they paid Susan, four million naira. Susan has squandered it already with her boyfriend. Hmm. Now please. I'm sorry. I promise you, everything will be different. Believe me. All right, ma. Um, Mr. J, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything. Um, for me, everything is now in the past. Let's face our future. Let's continue to live our lives. Um, <clears throat> uh, Madam Chamaka, I, I sincerely appreciate your level of maturity. I, it shows that you're a woman of virtue. I appreciate that. Jerry, to tell you the truth, all this praises should go to you for returning my daughter to me. Thank you, Jerry. Anytime. Ne. Listen. I want you to go to your room and shower. I'm going to prepare something very nice. And I will serve you myself. Yes, that's to tell you it's a new beginning. Just go to your room and shower. In my room. My room. <laughs> that's your room, yes? Yes. Okay, where is Susan? Oh, please. I do not want to talk about that thief. Please, please, do not spoil my day. No, no. Um, please tell your brother Barry to stop beating her. Oh. Noble men do not hit women. Tell him if he ever does, he will have me to contend with. I promise. It will never happen again. So don't bother yourself. It had better not happen again. It's all right, Jerry. Mm. Okay, my room. Mm. Okay. All right. Jerry. Um, I'll take my leave now. It's all right. Uh, Thank you, Jerry. Anytime. Thank you. Anytime. Susan. Are you not doing at the time? Yeah. What about the time? Hold on, Michael. Are you trying to send me away or something? Susan. All men who have plan of success in life know their weak point. 
I will not allow a beauty like you to spend the night here and you get tempted. I don't want to get personal with you for security reason on one side and for the fear of the unknown for the other side. I believe you have the same aura as your mom. Michael, what is the meaning of this rubbish you're saying? Are you in any way insinuating or saying that I should go back to my mother and be killed? No, 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 no. Your mother cannot kill you because you are all she has. Go back to your house and apologize to her. Four million naira she spent is nothing. She should be happy at least her jewelries are still intact. I don't blame you. No. I blame myself. Wise men avoid women that have link with strange forces. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have just moved into the middle class <laughs> and I can say my new life has started. Mm -hmm. I'm now enjoying life with the high class. Make it all a little bit in you. Life is good though. What is this hair you're carrying? What kind of stupid hair is this? So you have the audacity to return to this house after leaving that insult as a note? Huh? Wait a minute. Who asked you to bring your food to the room? You have the right to eat inside your... Place is in the kitchen. Why are you eating here? Hmm? I can see how they treated the poor Helen that made her run. <laughs> are you ignoring me? Are you in any way ignoring me? Am I not talking to a human being? Who gave you the right to eat in the room? That should be killed in this house. That person would be you. You are such a thief and a useless girl. Mom. Mom. Mom, you're talking to me like some strangers because of jewelries. It is me. You, Susan. Oh, that's the reason you got wasted. Thinking I'm helpless without you, right? Now you listen to me. You are a fool. Get out of my sight. 
This beautiful transformation. Hi, this is the daughter I always prayed for. God, I thank you. I thank you so much for you be God over my life forever. Amen. You will never share your glory with anybody, Almighty God. Good morning, sir. Just like that. Are you, are you mad? Are you mad? No, no, is it me that you're getting? Get me any, sir. Like that. The whole me. Oh, you are not new of the city of light. Are you stupid? You look, just look at your time. Look at. No, no, look at the time. Look at the time. And why are you sweeping this nonsense compound? When we are supposed to be heading for business. Are you mad? It's yours. You have understood that that loser only one is not good for you. He doesn't deserve an angel like you. Eh? He's a failure. You don't need him anywhere around you. Yes. Enjoy. Oh, enjoy. Let me go and arrange something for you to uh, uh, shower when you finish. Oh. Thank you, ma. You're the best. You're welcome. Huh? I'm happy you have realized that I'm the best thing that happened to you in your life. <laughs> it's okay. I'm coming. Oh? Yeah. Hello? Is it me that you're doing like this for? Is it me? Are you stupid? How dare you? You're simply a loser. And you do not deserve a woman like me. If you know what's good for you, Leave this compound right now. Make it up. Oh no, have you been smoking? Have you been? Where's my car? Um, where is my box of magic? I don't know what you're talking about. Leave me alone. I can't deal. Excuse me. Hey, am I dreaming? Make it up. Come back here. Oh, get Am I dreaming? No. Hello? You are not dreaming. I told you that one day your sins shall find you out. You're surprised, right? That is to tell you the chance. The useless chance you have been using to manipulate my daughter. To follow you all the useless blessings you used to go with her has finally cleared from her eyes. Now she can see clearly. And she would want to be left alone. Yeah, yeah, now, get I should only leave my compound. I should leave your compound. You no, no, why are you asking me to Shut leave? Shut up and keep quiet. You're asking me to leave this compound. Of course. It's not possible. She has my car and my box of magic from the most sacred conclave on earth. Abana Wezu, Naoma Mbala, in Aguler. So there's no way I will leave this place without my taste. It's not possible. Let, hey, 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 I'm get up. I have called the police. They are already on their way. Mom? Yes. Hey. Not the fight. Oh. Yeah, you're hey. worried now. Come and carry your things. Idiots. Come and carry your stupid conclave. You see me, my, 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 poor, my poor daughter. My daughter, oh, she didn't even hurt you. Oh, make it on the real, you 
You sound so frantic. What happened? Uncle Barry, that girl has bewitched my mother. Meaning? Meaning that mother do, do, does not see anything wrong with whatever she does. Strangely, she has become mother's favorite. And I know that that can only happen with charm. <laughs> she claims to be on a run. But I am sure that she has gone to get a charm to make mother see her as a queen. You are talking like a child. Um, anyway, where is your mother? Okubari, you have to believe me. You just have to believe me. My mother went out early for a business meeting. Okay. Okubari, do you know that? That idiot is still lying there. Do you believe that? She started a fight with me last night and mother did nothing but support her. What? I called you so you go in there and hit her again. What the hell is going on here? What kind of air style is this? My friend, will you pull that enough? Oh, okay, okay, shut up. Must you be rude? Must you be rude? Why would you barge into a woman's room like that? What if I was naked? If Obana, okay? Me? Barry? <laughs> Are you talking to me? Um. Please tell your brother Barry to stop beating her. Oh. Noble men do not hit women. Tell him if he ever does, he will have me to contend with. Yes, I'm talking to you. Oh, you think it's the last time? I will not tolerate any nonsense from you. Now get out or so. Get uh, out! Me, get out! I should get out, eh? feeling that you are beaten up by a group of guys who didn't even give you the opportunity to defend yourself. Man, 
Am I right or wrong? <laughs> Donald, please concentrate on the massage, okay? <sighs> B, why are you not telling me what happened to you? Oh, God. <sighs> okay, fine. Since you want to know, I had an accident, okay? Donna, I am in pain. <sighs> Thank you. Ah! No accident without a scratch. Ah! Spiritual caterpillar. Ah, yeah. Sorry, huh? Mm. Sorry. Ay! Hold on. Sorry. Ah! Sorry. Ah! Yeah, caterpillar could get. Ah! Shit! Sorry. Ah! Ah! Oh. Sorry, oh. oh my god, girl, in all honesty, I love your transformation. I'm so happy with it. What transformation are you talking about? Look at you, you've changed. You're now a very classy girl with fashionable sense. I think we can run this together. Run things like what? Come on. I know men that can give you real money. Real money, if only you allow me to introduce them to you. Is that your impression of me? No, tell me, what do you take me for? You think I'm one of those girls that go about sleeping with men for money? I don't fall in that category. Please, don't ever say this to me, else I'll fall out with you. Calm down. Calm down. Are you trying to tell me that you're allergic to money? What did I just say? These men will give you real money, real cash. But you're not a child of God. Please, forget about that. Helen? <laughs> Helen! Am I dreaming or what? Oh, excuse me. Please, do you know that girl? Yeah, she's my friend. Why do you ask? I need to know everything about that girl. Excuse me, mister. I don't even know you. Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if I'm a man, I can't talk Oh, well, I am bad, I can't Hello. Oh, yeah, hello. Please, I just want to confirm if Ellen is in that house. Of course, she's right here with me. Why did you ask? There is something confusing right now. I'll call you back later. All right then. Hello, excuse me. Hey, guy. This one has spiritual teaching. This one has telescopic stealing. I wonder why you're bringing me here. Now listen, Barry, if it's because of Helen, please free me. What I am going to tell you right now is extremely important. And I want you to open your ears and listen attentively. Oh. All right then. What is it? I'm listening. That girl in there, she's not Helen. I beg your pardon? What do you mean by that? 
I am telling you the truth. She's an imposter. I ran into Ellen today. Immediately I called her name. She ran away. Though I, I, I got her information from one guy. So I traced her to where she now stays with her. One well, madam. Madam Vero. Yeah. I still don't believe you. Oh, come on, sister. Sister, you have to believe me. Yes. Okay, now think about this. Ever since that intruder came into this house, has she ever been to any church to pray? You see? Has she been walking the way Helene used to walk in this house? Sister, that girl is an intruder. The earlier we brief the police, the better for everybody in this house. I was waiting for you to come back so I could tell you I'm leaving. What are you talking about? Where are you leaving to? You belong here. This is me, your mother. Where possibly can you be going to? I'm sorry, you're not my mother. My mother died in a ghastly motor accident when I was a kid. And my father died a few days after. My name is Helen. I am not your Elizabeth. Please. Hey! Look at her. No, 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 come, come, come. That is the girl. I'm here, don't worry, could just come. My darling, come. Arrest her, please. We still consider this a civil case. Do not resist arrest and turn it into a criminal case. Can someone tell me what is going on here? Madam, lock your door. You are going with us to the station. When we get there, we shall explain things to you. Please move. Why am I so unfortunate? Why is everyone hating me? Oh, well, if I'm a man, I can't She's with her husband and they're looking for help. I know that's your job. Don't worry, just show me where she is. <laughs> where she is. Hey! Where is she?
God, thank you. Thank you for making this happen in a place where there is no. Eh? Get it from my car, do no. Hey, thank you. Dalo. Hey, God bless you. God bless you. Hey. Thank you. Hey. It's been three hours. Hmm? Is it a problem? Were you having a problem with the delivery? I can make a decision. No, there will be no need for that. Your wife has been delivered of a bouncing baby girl. Hey! 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 Thank God. Mm -hmm. Thank God. Can I see them? Can I see my wife and my baby? No, 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 no. She's very weak now. You know, she had a prolonged labor. Just give her an hour. She'll be fit for you to see her. I told you, she's safe in my hands. Thank yeah. you so much, Metron Vero. Thank you. God bless you. I'm very grateful. Thank you. Hey. And your thank baby God. is very beautiful. Yeah, thank you. Thank hey. you. Just your color like this. Yeah, thank you so <laughs> much. Take that. So hey. sit down and wait for Thank her. you so Oops. much. I can't believe this policy. How could you drive a woman that is due all the way to Bodami? Knowing for where I told you never to leave this town. So you did, Doctor, and I never had the intention of disturbing you. Uh, this sudden call came in that she should come and sign something in B and T office in Obodan. And they said it has to be today. So I had no option. So why didn't she tell them that her doctor advised her never to leave town? Oh, Doctor, she did. But this woman insisted that she must come, else she will lose the job. Doctor. Don't blame anyone, okay? Uh, eventually, God took all the glory. Yes, we met a registered nurse who helped us with the delivery. The mother is fine, the baby is fine. We're back home. <sighs> okay. First thing tomorrow morning, you bring her to the hospital. A registered nurse is just a nurse and not a doctor. I need to examine them myself. No problem, Doctor. It's okay, it's fine. Vero, do you ever know the implication of what you did? There is no implication to anything because you know very well that I couldn't have been able to conceive. And God, in His infinite mercy, has given me a child. I expect you, my husband, to be happy for me. As your wife, that child is only your child. Vero, this is ridiculous. A helpless couple needed you to help them with child delivery. You delivered the lady of twins. You stole one child and gave one child to the couple. Without missing words, this is criminal offense. And I'm not going to be part of that criminal act. Zoro, listen to me. Do not provoke me. You know I have your data in my palms. The certificate for which you got promoted in the Navy. Have you forgotten it was forged? You want me to open up? Shut up. I beg your pardon. Don't listen. Don't, don't look at me with that your wicked military eyes. Because you know exactly what I'm talking about. Don't open up to anyone on that child. Because if you do, I will go to the Navy and open up your fraudulent practices to them because you have been using that document to rise through the ranks and file in the Navy. This is our child. And we are husband and wife. You must see her as our child. The choice is yours. Women. Anyway, if it will interest you, I have called agents. We are moving out of this house. What the heck are you talking about? Agent? Another house? Yes. Zoro, I do not want to compromise that child for anything. I don't want that couple to come back and notice the child. Not even our uh, uh, neighbors. I don't want them to start nosing around to know what you are doing here. We are living here urgently. I mean, as quickly as possible. 
I don't want you to argue with me on this because my mind is already made up. We are man and wife and we are in this together. You open me up, I open you up. That child should be your child. You should be happy to have one. Look at you, you're old. How will you have another one? Please. Everything is perfect. The person who took delivery of the child seems to be very experienced. Yeah. She's a registered nurse. The way she handled the delivery was so nice. I didn't even know what was happening. It was as if I was knocked out. I finally woke up to see my child already cleaned, wrapped, and was lying beside me. Well, I don't know her, but I give it to her that she knows what she's doing. I insisted on seeing you because I want to be sure you are okay with your child. I'm satisfied. Thank you, Dr. Innocent. You're welcome. I appreciate your concern. Hmm? We are very okay, sir. I have to be on my way, sir. Okay, but remember, to come straight to the hospital once you notice anything abnormal in the child. Certainly, Doctor. I will do just that. I'll send my greetings to your husband. Okay, sir. Who is that, please? Hold on. Hold on, please. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. How may I help you? Oh, my name is Paulson. Uh, I'm here to see uh, one Madame Vero. Oh, Madame Vero, the nurse. Yes, yeah, the nurse. My name is Paulson. Yeah, he, she saved my wife's life, and I cannot forget such a woman. Wow. Yes. Ha, but she's no longer living here. What? For real? Yes. I'm, since when? Uh, they packed out two weeks ago. I'm the new tenant here now. Oh, okay. Um, do you have any idea where I can see them? Ah, uh, my brother. You know what about people in this town? They mind their business. She didn't tell us and we don't care to know. Oh. She couldn't even wait for me to come back and thank her. Uh, All right, thank you so much. You're thank welcome. you. All right. You're welcome. All right. Have a nice day. Thank you. All right. All right. Bye-bye. Thank you. Just very confusing. Why would she live without leaving a trace? Well, it's possible she doesn't want us to ever thank her. Um, she has already shown us the signs that she believes her reward should come from heaven. <laughs> yes, I think that was why she left. Oh, wow. I am still surprised we have people like that. Hmm? Well? I don't know what else to say, but only God knows that we've tried our best to locate her. Uh, it's so unfortunate that she's nowhere to be found. I simply hope that she will not use this against us in the future. <laughs> That's just my concern. That is a possibility. But if that happens, God in heaven will bear us witness that we did forget someone that helped us. That is it, though. It is well. 
I am the architect of this whole problem. I was frustrated because I couldn't conceive, I couldn't be a child of my own. <laughs> In the course of my duties as a nurse, I delivered a woman of a set of twins, two girls. I hid one. <laughs> Gave her one to go home with. Helen here was the one she went home with. And Elizabeth was the one I hid. <coughs> it's so sad that I've come back to where life kept me a barren woman. But the truth has to be told. My child, <laughs> I didn't mean it for evil. Please forgive me. Elizabeth, please forgive me. Forgive me. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Oh, I'm a Oh, yeah, come on, Oh, yeah, come Hey, yeah, 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 Why am I so unfortunate? 